For the next 50 hours, I'll be surviving in better Minecraft. Winter is coming and that means food is scarce. Enemies have more locations to spawn in and that means more moments for me to scream and be terrified. I did manage to venture into the nether and that was nearly the end of me. For whatever reason, this mod pack was bringing out all of its horrors this time. My goals for this movie are to create a bee farm. It, it'll make sense, trust me. Villager trading outposts, explore the nether and collect a few important blocks and locations and more. You'll love it. Now, here's me surviving 50 hours in better Minecraft. Enjoy. Oh my god. I'm going to assume with these. That's... What was that? Oh my lag. Oh my god. Oh my... Also get some saplings for it so I can redo all. Oh my Jesus. Higher village though. So... Oh my god. Oh, hi. Bye. Archery is definitely the way to do it. Ah. Oh my. And oh god, it's a wiener. Are you Captain Jack Sparrow? Achoo. Hope they didn't like that. I did not like Oh my. Near where I was, you know, digging down. Oh my. I kind of want to kill the miner. Not that kind of miner. So everything in here does damage and everything wants to kill you. Can, can you mine? Uh. Jesus Christ. I never end up using them. God, you guys shoot so rapidly. Oh. Ow. Uh, I don't really want to run into those guys and you know, oh my god. Dear god. Hi. All right, a failure. Let's do this. Okay, I need you to not shoot me at all. Okay. I didn't even turn the corner. Why, hello there. Long time no see. You guys seem to really, really like this series. So, um, hey, welcome back to episode two. Now, first thing that's super duper important, which I was honestly, um, really surprised by the support on this. So, um, thank you. Uh, I'm in regular. I I'm not in hardcore anymore. Took several hours to figure out how to do that. Yeah, I mean, you can't really tell because of the uh, texture pack, but the hearts, you know, I'm, I'm not in hardcore anymore. So, that means that we can actually go on adventures and I don't have to really care about dying because I won't lose the world. Another thing which it, it had to deal with waste stones. Super important. Apparently if I make a knife go this like that boom make an iron knife then if I go over to uh these grass blocks apparently if I break some of them yes we actually get straw because okay, so then we could turn this into rope or something. Canvas. No, I don't want that. We then take the straw, do three up like that. Boom, we get rope, which I'm actually really positive. I had like 60 of that or maybe like 128 of those in my chest somewhere. Like I could have sworn I had a lot. Oh, hey, look, I have a lot. <laughs> oh, I didn't need to make that uh, knife at all, but I know I can use that for other stuff. If we go here, we can actually make just a ton of leads like that. Boom. Now we have 15. So um, I really like rope. Wait, I have knives. So I really didn't need to make that one. Whatsoever. Okay, that's that's cool. I'm, I'm smart. Okay, anyways, what I'm trying to get to is that you guys say in the comments, like if we go to uh, here, I won't lie. I kind of forgot about some of my adventures on here. Okay, so we don't want to be at this one. We actually want this one, maybe. Here, we, we can do a test with the iron golem. So if I lead you, and then apparently if I go to a waystone, teleport back home, um, let's do home village. Uh, no, he's not with me. And I've now lost the lead. Okay, wait, wait. We need to go back. Uh, I want that lead back. Where are you? Okay, so never mind. Nope. Uh, might be with a different version of Minecraft. That's my only guess. But hey, at least we tested it out. However, the leads are not useless. You know, if I travel around here, boom, we can go and get more animals. Because it actually looks like you guys are interested in me, uh, making a farm or like actual vegetables and stuff and an animal farm. And especially after getting this amazing panda the rarest one in the game can you look at me yes yes the sneezing sick one unbelievably like happy and energetic right now that's kind of weird for someone who's sick but after receiving that oh yeah no i, I want to go crazy you guys made a baby i don't remember ever giving you guys any like seeds or anything to breed okay Sweet. well we now have an ins like insanely adorable little uh, baby duck and another idea that one of you gave me was actually turning this part right here into an aquarium so we can actually you know catch some really cool looking fish if there is any because uh i won't lie i haven't really seen anything underwater that looks really cool but I'm, I'm sure, you know, it's, it's cool. Maybe. However, I think our best thing before we start focusing on animals and like farms and stuff and getting all of our like base looking bigger and cooler. Oh God, we need bees. Um, I, I want to work on villagers and uh, get like diamond armor, you know, get protected, get all the enchantments that I want. And um, oh, I need bees. 
kind of bad. Where are you going? Why? Do you, please don't run away from the village. I would like for you to stay. Um, I won't lie. Oh, thank you. Good, good. He's coming back. Now, I don't know, but I would like to test this out. First off, we need to go find some bees. Oh my god, I actually caught you. No way. <laughs> good, good. Now you can't run. Okay, wait, that just sounds weird. Here you go. You can go back into nature. See, I'm not gonna hurt you. I could have sworn there were bees, like, somewhere near my base. Also, I believe it's starting to become fall in game. Surely there's some bees in here, right? Like, there's so many flowers. How, how could they resist? Oh, wait, I totally forgot. I can kind of cheat and just look at my mini map, and then that will tell me if there's any bees, which there really isn't. Oh, boy. Okay, maybe if we travel more of this direction, because I don't want to go into a jungle, I'm very positive that there wouldn't be any over there. Hi, don't touch me, please. What are you, huh? Well, with the uh, spoiler alerts, uh, there's a lot of witches in there, Um, which isn't a good thing. <laughs> Uh, oh, bees! Wait, I see them on the minimap. Bees don't disappear. Future Skies here. If you're enjoying the movie so far, it'd mean a lot to me if you'd subscribe, as these take a lot of time and effort to make. If you'd like to see episode 3, just 30,000 likes and I'll release it. Lastly, for anyone wanting to watch me play other games, you should go subscribe to my second channel. There's already dozens of hours of content on there. Also, follow my Twitter, please. Now, back to the movie. Okay, well, we'll check out the uh, the witches later. The bees are way more important. Okay, well, here's their beehive. Here's one thing I want to figure out. If I hold shift, can I pick you up? That's a no. Okay, so the next best thing is... Did I just see a bee? Where are the bees? Wait, right, that's also interesting. I swear, like, I don't even know if I have ADHD, but this mod pack really brings it out of me. Ooh, a nice cluster. Six shard. Huh, sure. I have no idea what these are uh, useful for or if they're useful at all, but uh, hey, I don't mind collecting all of them. Okay, anyways, uh, before the bees come back... <gasps> Which there's one right here. Yes, yes, yes. Please, below, below the tree line, please. <gasps> you, come here. Yes. Oh, okay. I can at least pick up this bee because I was really stupid and I left all of my leads back at home. But I can bring this bee all the way back to my base. And if I can get you inside without getting you killed, that would be greatly appreciated. Uh, okay. Put you there. Boom. Oh, come here. Come here. Come here. Thank you. Okay. And just to make it harder for you to escape, we'll put you up here in my bedroom. And there you go. And you are already trying to escape. Nice. Um, yeah, you can do 360s over there. I'm going to go down here. And uh, yeah, let's go get the other bee. Actually, no, 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 no. It's actually important. So we should... Oh, but I don't have honey. Okay, wait, wait, wait. We need to get shears. If I can find a beehive with honey in it, then I can make a beehive all the way over here. So that'll be good. I just need to make sure I don't have any shears already before I go and make more. Okay, so we got the shears. Got everything else that we need. And now that we're fully kitted up to go and hopefully find some honey. What if I shear a beehive and then I make the bees all ingy wingy at me and then they start chasing me? Can I pick them up so that then they won't sting me but uh anyway so we're gonna run back to that forest since that i think that was like the only area other than where the uh mushrooms were wait i see a bee on my mini map hello god i love the spoiler can i pick you up oh my god i can pick it up we can actually have coconut crabs back at our house kind of cool i think i wonder if i could breed them oh god where did the bee go wait is there a beehive in one of the buildings oh mr b where did you go I know you're around here somewhere. I'm gonna get you, but not in like a creepy way. I'm, I'm I'm gonna get you and like, we're gonna be productive together and make it so that villagers can never escape me. That also doesn't make it sound any better, but I swear like it's not gonna be that bad. Okay, the beehive has to be around here in the trees somewhere. Which I mean, I could just start cutting down the trees and then it'll leave the beehive, but that'll be a lot of durability on an ax that's already- <gasps> There you are, that's almost broken. And hello? Oh, there's two of you, okay. Oh, here, before I pick you up, I'll, I'll let you guys, you know, get your pollen on your tushies. Okay, good, good. Now, where's your base? For no particular reason, huh? Yeah, you're, uh, you're getting stuck. Okay, wait, wait. Might be down here. You sure travel? Oh, nice. <gasps> okay, uh, the other one's not near. Let me just do that. Run. 
We can up run. Okay, well, there's two bees inside of that. Um, okay, well, I can actually make a beehive now. So, hey, I, I need one of you to come out. Actually, let's be real. I'll, I'll take both of you. Here, let me, uh, nah, nah, we won't use leads. I'll be stupid and just do it one at a time. It's less annoying that way. I just need you to come out. Uh, here, while you take forever, let me, uh, through and just start collecting some ores. No, we might as well be productive while we, uh, wait our hostages out. Oh, not bad. Got 62 from that and they're still not coming out. I mean, I, I can break the beehive, but I don't want to make them that mad at me. Surely this won't take long. Oh wow, that actually didn't take that long. That was like 30 seconds maybe. Come here, come, come here, come here. Thank you. Okay, just need to be fast before the other one gets out and like goes back in. Quickly, come here. Yep, thank you. Uh, die. stay up here. Stay up here. Don't worry. You guys are going to have a mansion soon. Don't worry. I always take care of the bees. No, 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 no. Wait, wait, you're still up there, right? Wait, nah. Oh, no, stay. Just stay, okay? Oh, God, they can press the uh, pressure plates. They can actually get out. Did I just say press or did I say press? No, wait, wait. Can I see beehives on my mini map? It's like that brown little box over this direction or is that something else? Wait, now there's three of them. Wait, what is that? I want to say it's snails, but I don't see them. Huh. Oh, well. Uh, anyways, uh, Mr. B, would you like to be abducted now? Okay, good. He's still in there. <gasps> Finally, thank you. And uh, come here, come here, come here, come here. Thank you. Okay, good. Now that we've abducted the entire family, and beautiful, you're all in here. Please get away from the ladder. Thank you. Now, if I were to make a beehive area, um, I mean, we do have the perfect space right there to actually make another staircase going off to somewhere else, which I mean, I'm kind of down to do because we just break this one block and then maybe we have a staircase go on top of the mountain. Okay, I mean, you know, we got, we got some building room up here because... I think up here, instead of down there, just cause like I don't wanna build it too close to the village, maybe we start expanding this direction. And up here, we can actually build our uh, entire villager trading area. God, I really don't know how I wanna build that. Uh, because I don't wanna make it a long rectangle like in uh, 100 days on a raft. I mean, hmm, maybe we build like a giant pyramid? Cause I'm trying to think of stuff that I haven't built before. I mean, we could also build it underground, but I feel like that's really boring. But I mean, regardless, you know, that's for later who, who even knows if i build it this episode but for the beehive i kind of want to actually make it a little bit big because i would like to have a lot of bees in there just in case if there's like other building blocks from honey that i can use uh if i use a lot of villagers you know i i'm i might also build with it but now to add a little bit of an obstacle so i saw in uh, some comments and I'll, I'll agree to it you know uh, you guys want me to try building with modded blocks stuff that's just like not really vanilla or at least something other than oak stone and bushes which you know um i might have already you know made everything out of that issue is i don't know how to get modded blocks or really any other kind of blocks unless we go uh mining and i might be able to find some like special blocks underground like i have in episode one in some areas i believe or we might be able to get lucky and find some stuff in the zombie dungeon which you know it seems like the locals are uh, still down there active as ever uh can i place a torch anywhere Ooh, I can right there and right there. Beautiful. But I also really don't think that I'm going to find anything like special down here. So I think, I mean, it would be good to go mining, but I don't really need that many ores as I am fairly wealthy from our uh, exploration stuff. Wait, I have oak beehive. Dog, how much stuff do I have? How, how am I so unaware of everything? You know what? I don't care. I'm still going to make it. Mm -hmm. So I think our best first thing to do is uh, go on another adventure where looking at our map let's not head this direction as we got unbelievably unlucky and let's actually just head i think we can go south so if we head this direction oh we should also really tend to our sugar cane since it actually grew for once okay much better and luckily for us our focus on this is going to be entirely on collecting resources for the beehive right and i guess also like future buildings one thing i'm curious about so if i use an axe can i actually collect these no, it just gives me seeds. Uh, okay, well, I don't really care for wheat seeds. I wouldn't- uh, I don't have the shears on me. Can I use this to collect the- Oh, I can. Okay. Oh, that's- That's actually kind of fun. So, here's a modded block. 
never really built with the color yellow before so you know we could probably do something with this might use this as an outside decoration since it would be kind of annoying to, you know keep track of bees and this since you know they'll just get lost super easy so maybe something outside would be very well with this i think like nearly two stacks of so that should be perfectly fine up next so i mean i can still work with woods and maple maple looks like it would give me like a grayish design maybe white but i don't want to strip it just yet maybe that'll be like a good adjacent color for the building and at least we're getting saplings for it um okay and then there's different types of maple so we'll work with that because it'd be kind of cool to work with white i just really want to be picky with anything that i get um oh wait you don't think oh wait so regardless of the color of the leaves the wood is going to be the exact same i'm going to assume which i guess is fine yeah i mean i remember a lot of you saying how there's like modded blocks in here but i mean you know looking around i'm really not seeing any oh here if we're gonna be using some like white looking uh maple logs maybe we want to try out diorite maybe like I, I don't know if it'll look good or not i'll see what i can do maybe we could use this for part of the flooring There we go. Huh. I finally collected all of it. That was a lot more than I was expecting. And I have like four and a half stacks of dye right now, which, you know, I was just collecting a lot just in case if I actually, you know, want to use it all for building. And, you know, it would kind of suck if I ran out of it. So we got that. Uh, to the right, it just looks like more of the same stuff. And, uh, okay, never mind. Actually, both directions. And let's just keep traveling this way. Maybe we can get lucky and find some new blocks. Maybe some other color of wood. Oh, I wonder. Okay, maybe I do want to collect one of the red trees because I... Mm, I don't know if it matters for the modded wood, but something that you guys told me is that the leaves will change colors, like the pink ones that are in front of my house. They'll change colors depending on the uh, the season. But uh, no, these are actually just stay like this. The red and the white, that might actually be kind of fun to build with. Oh, dude, maybe for the beehive, it's like a, a red and white look. Maybe, maybe that's what we do. So, yeah, if that's the case, I'm gonna go around and collect a whole lot of these. Also get some saplings for it so I can, you know, redo all of them back at base high god i hate this moss okay so now that we somewhat have a color palette selected i really want to find more white blocks uh diorite is cool wood is cool ah, i really wish i could build with white but that's oh hi well you might be fun you know I, i'm not in hardcore anymore so i'm down to tango with the boy uh, oh god oh god okay okay chill 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 I'm down to tango with the boys. Uh, you know, I'll, I'll take the easy way up. I can loot before they all get mad and calm over. Hello, my God. Hi. Yes, I really like your stuff. I would really greatly appreciate it if I can steal it all. Oh my God, you guys shoot so rapidly. Oh God, run, 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 run. Oh my God, I don't want to die just because I'm in regular. My loot goblin heart wouldn't be able to bear leaving all that stuff behind. Which I need to remember, I do have a bow. I, I really don't need to go around and hit everything. And I don't have to play fair, you know? We can, uh, we can be a little cheesy. Let's see, where are you hiding? Whoop! Ah, bye. Bye. Here we go. Yes, yes. I think we're safe. So I can go over here and hi. I will actually be taking all of that. Oh, I can make another axe. That's beautiful. <gasps> Iron boots that are better than mine. Uh, oh, I'll take more rope. Why not? Don't care for the food or that. I really just don't care for the music disc. I I'm sorry to everyone out there who's like in love with all of them. Probably screaming at me right now to, you know, take it. But eh, never end up using them. I don't know why you guys always have a furnace in here. You're never gonna like have anything in there for me to steal. Hello, hi, ow. There we go. Yeah, now I... archery is definitely the way to do it. Ow. Oh my god, don't make me fall off. Just wait one second. Thank you. Okay. Phew. I had to make sure that you guys couldn't respawn in here. Ow, stop. Ooh. Hello. <gasps> Hello. Beautiful. That's now repaired. Sharpness one and comb cutter. Ah, uh, I would take it, but I mean, I already have a diamond sword. Why would I downgrade? And now the last area. Wow, this is so much fun not playing in hardcore. You can go around all brave like. Hello. Ow. Oh, God. Oh, 
that he has a boyfriend. Okay, light it up, light it up. We should be safe. I don't think there's any higher levels. And oh god, am I lagging? Oh god, I'm lagging. Okay. Okay, well, beautiful. I can drop my chest plate. I can wear this one. Beautiful. Okay, so armor's basically repaired. Uh, interesting. Don't really care for you. Sure, I'll take another iron pick. Why not? Ooh, a bow with power one. Uh, pff, never mind. Mine is absolutely amazing. Okay. Oh, sure. I'll repair my fully healed up helmet. Take these. Luckily, another diamond. Deep fry, deep fry. Reeling in certain fish will cook them. That's actually kind of cool. I'll take that. Ooh, and we got a treasure map. And I will take that gunpowder. And sure, I'll take a bee stinger. Why not? That sounds like fun. Uh, I don't think we need anything else. Maybe the string, actually. Usually, that's always something valuable that I don't really have that much of. And you, are you a treasure map? You are a treasure map. I'm going to assume that you're super duper far away, but hey, let's go. <gasps> oh, wait. I also realized, so we do have... Oh, God, I need to sleep. Okay, just nothing spawn in here. Uh, actually, wait, you're new. I haven't, oh yeah, I haven't even looted this. Hello, I'm so sorry. But, oh God. Uh, oh, it's just snails. Why am I getting scared by snails? Okay, they have weird sounds. Uh, first off, taking the lanterns. And four, which there is one more up here. Uh, thank you. Now this building does have some fun colors to work with. But I'm just... I don't know. I'm not feeling it. Like, none of it's, like, uh, screaming out to me, you know, fun stuff to use in a build. So, I think we'll leave that. Um, I... What? Oh, my God. It's a seal. Holy... Dude, I looked at the minimap, and I thought it was a pillager. I thought I was going to be in danger. Okay, so we want to head roughly this direction for the map. Which, if we're lucky, we can actually just use a boat for a majority of it. So, so we can travel nice and fast. Hopefully, with a lot of good loot inside of it. There's nothing dangerous in the ocean, right? I mean, I, I've already traveled through the ocean, but I, I'm just, I'm not used to these packs being, like, nice and easy for me. <gasps> oh, village. Uh, wait, there might be a waystone in there. Okay, here, here. We're, we're gonna go check this out, and then we'll get back to exploring. Oh, you look kind of nice as well. Wait, this actually looks like, like a good village. Oh, oh, wait, never mind. Wow, okay, I thought that was one of the dungeons. Never mind, I'm, I'm silly. I'm a little goofy right now all righty let's see do i loot you up or do i leave you be uh, and you don't really have any food oh <gasps> you do have a cooking pot even though i i know i do have several at home Ooh, yeah we need to get into cooking once we get back home let's see chef's delight yeah okay well we might go back for that i'm gonna check out the other buildings first since you know i do have a looting problem so i just want to make sure that i don't get like completely full off of like useless things <gasps> Ooh, also torches. Yes, give me. Oh, wow. Yeah, that, that would have killed, man. That would have been fun. Now, there we are. There's one villager. Why is this a ghost town? <gasps> Hello. There we go. Rename you. Beautiful. Now we can always come back here. Mm, man, God. Part of me really just wants to take everything from this village and just loot it up. Ah, but I can always just teleport back here, so it might be smart to, you know, try and leave the villagers with some way of living, if they even can. Ooh, another one. Thank you. Mm. Oh! Ooh, even more thank you i think i have onions back at home i don't think i need to like really worry about any of the uh vegetation to bring it back to my base but definitely once we get back home and i make that b area like make the b building oh that's kind of cool what are you shrek but i do want to start on farming and actually making like the custom food items because uh, there was another comment about this where i always talk about the uh the food mods but i never uh actually like do anything with them or make modded food so for this series definitely want to get into that if you guys are interested in uh food mods and like watching me do farming stuff and you know making cool foods okay and even though it's raining super duper hard and it looks like a storm is a brewing i think we should be safe to go Oh, okay, good, good. You're nothing dangerous. Oh, but you're kind of beautiful. Oh, wait, are you? Oh, wait, you're just like a regular mountain looking thing. What did I just pick up? Item frame and black banner. What? Is there something underwater? Oh my God. Wait, wait, wait. There's actually something underwater. Hello. What are you? Smithing table and a chest. Let me get some oxygen. Oh my gosh. Hi. Cyclopedia of Eden. Sure. And a quiver. Some redstone. Sure. What did I find? Uh, we got a barrel with cobwebs and a furnace and a drowned spawner. Uh, don't worry. I know exactly what to do with you. If I don't die by doing this. Hurry, 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 hurry. 
Beautiful. Okay. Uh, oxygen. Uh, interesting. I really wasn't expecting that at all. Uh, I'm glad those items went to my inventory. Never would have noticed that at all on my own. Which, speaking of iron, I just want to say, when I kept finding all of those copper mountain block things, like near some of those uh, camps in episode one, I didn't realize it was iron next to it. I thought it was cobblestone. It wasn't my fault. Like, there's no way looking back on that video, like looking at that footage, that, that does not look like iron, right? Like, I'm not the only one who thought that, huh? <gasps> And hello, beautiful. Oh, I see that I have uh, spotted my next resource run. On how adorable. There's a villager on it, lost at sea. Um, okay, just so you don't come onto my boat like the last guy, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave it right there. You know, like I, I just know that you're having so much fun just, you know, being out at sea that I, I don't want to take that away from you, but I will take all of your items from you. Hello. Okay, eh, I'll take you. Why not? That's nice. Yeah, don't mind me, buddy. Oh my gosh, there's so much. Uh, no, 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 I have to help. Okay. Cool, and don't care for any of that. I, I'm trying to be generous and kind, and it's definitely not because, you know, I'm trying to limit myself on all the stuff that I pick up so I can actually, you know, loot more stuff while I'm out and about. Totally not because of that. I definitely have a change of heart towards villagers. And beautiful. Well, um, Rosabelle Valadez, the fisherman. Uh, it was a pleasure doing business with you. Good luck out here at sea. And, uh, yep, I'll never see you again. Bye. And is that another thing that I see that I can loot? Well, there's apparently one... Are you Captain Jack Sparrow? Johnny Depp? Is that you? Hi, uh, how you doing? Abigail Bazaar. Huh? Well, hello. Huh. Oh, thank you. See you later. Good luck. How are we not getting any closer at all? I swear, every single time I get one of these maps, it gives me a spot that's like 4,000 blocks away from me. Oh, also, while I'm uh, rowing all the way to hopefully this treasure spot, would you guys be interested in me doing a mega build? Because, like, the last one that I've ever done was the Autoinator back in my hardcore series, like, a year ago. But, you know, don't worry. Haven't left it yet. I'm, I'm just, like, really bored of uh, vanilla Minecraft and also hardcore is, like, super oversaturated and done on YouTube, so I don't really care to do it. Anyways... Would you guys be interested in me making like a mega build and then maybe we make that for like capturing a lot of the mobs in here? Like maybe we can make it our farm area and our animal area, you know? What are you? Oh boy. Well, I don't know if they're in this mod pack, but I do know that dragons like to hang around blocks like that. But I mean, I haven't seen a dragon yet, so I don't think they're in this mod pack. Let's check one thing from this tree. Is this a apple oak? No, that's just an or orchard uh eh. don't touch me uh darn i would have loved to have had an apple tree back in my base and let's see looking at the map uh still no progress has been made i'm pretty sure i've traveled over a thousand blocks so far for it what is that what is that green looking little thing right above the the villagers is that a new mob Ooh, it's a new village let's see let's see what is it what is it is it a new golem over here <gasps> oh, what? Ooh, ow, what, is, what are you? Oh my god, it's the copper golems. So it's the copper golems that are like worshiping a god? Wait, you're so cool. Can I pick you up? <gasps> I can. What if I put you here? God, I want to keep you so badly. Uh, like, I want to hit it to see if I can like harvest it, but I don't want to hurt it and then have it start attacking me. Oh my gosh, dude, I actually want these. These are so cool. Let's see. Is this village lucky enough to have a waystone like right there? Yes, it is. Okay. Well, I guess I. I won't break you and then for this one i have a really good name here we go we'll call it cop gold village as in like copper golem village so yeah at least then i can always come back here beautiful wow so this place is sick oh my gosh i wish i lived here oh that would have been a really nice spot to actually build a base like right there it's nice and flat you're up in the mountains so we could have built like some like cool looking elevated buildings Ooh. hi oh what do you sell uh, no 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 stop sitting you what was that Curse of Frozen Touch 2 transfers heat from you to your enemies when attacking. Why is that red? Why is that a curse? That sounds kind of cool. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, no, I'll leave your torches. Uh, but I will harvest this tree to make it easier for us to get through. Okay, maybe if it wants to move. Okay, there we go. Now we can actually walk. You guys are welcome. Oh, I think I'm gonna take it. And that. Oh, yeah. No, no, I have to. It's heavily important to me that I collect every single, uh, 
aquarium. Okay. Anyways, eh, I don't, oh, hello, what are you? Because I got to be honest for once, I don't really care to loot the village as, you know, it's not that important for me to get that kind of loot. Because I know you'll find it hard to believe I actually am still looking for blocks to build with. It just looks like everything here is like really vanilla. Uh, what are you? Are you like the hated villager that everyone just like really wanted out of the village? Oh, <gasps> hello. Because what's up here? Okay, okay, more loot. Okay. Halbert Gossen the fisherman. Well, I hate to like be like this towards you, but um, you're not really near any water up here. Hello. And hello. Hey, you're not the worst, but hello. Nice, nice. Take all that. Ooh, smite one. Really don't care and don't care for that one. Uh, let me get up here so you don't touch me because you're weird. So we do have a bundle and I think I could just put like anything in it, right? Like it, it doesn't matter if they're different. Interesting. Bundles are so bizarre to me. So only 46 items total. So like it wouldn't be good for me to have gunpowder in there so we'll use other stuff here we'll put the aquarium stuff in there so i can't put books in there it's a little bizarre don't you think uh Okay, I've actually managed to get even more organized than I was before. So meaning I can actually loot even more stuff. But interesting, I, I honestly never would have expected that towers like this would be villagers. That's a spider cave with actual loot inside of them. So uh, was fun, homie. Uh, I, I will be uh, taking my leave. Please, for the love of God, to lay on this, don't die. Uh, I'm, I, I'm, no, I'm scared. I'm too scared. I don't know why. I feel like I'm going to mess it up. I, I, I haven't been lucky with my water buckets recently. I'm too scared now. Okay, anyways, after all of that super duper fun stuff, plus we can come back here. There has to be some way that I can bring mobs through a waypoint. Uh, the, oh no, the, the, the waystone thing. Like, there has to be a way. Because if we could do that, I will very happily build a mega structure again. I get like a thousand blocks wide or something and then we can just have like every single mob in there with like their own little room be kind of cool maybe make it look futuristic because i kind of miss the uh auto -inator. oh the farm up there's so like you know we'll, we'll be needing a whole lot of space what are you firecracker leaves you're kind of cool wait can i get a uh, sapling of you do you drop saplings here at the very least i'll just pick some of you that's kind of cool actually wait no now i'm thinking about it these would actually be really really cool for the beehive and i don't know if i can make more of these so we'll collect a lot of you because you might be really nice inside of the building because it's really not looking like i'll be able to get any saplings from the bushes oh okay wait i know i don't have these back at base whatsoever so yes yes please more god i get distracted so much oh this is gonna take me forever to complete my quest i think i'm good to move on i now have seven more in there so that's like mm, like 81 i think off the top of my head but let's continue this way please let me jump continue this way we're now hitting the hilly areas which maybe we might be able to find some cool blocks <gasps> oh oh my god wait hello Ooh, you're kind of a cool biome jacaranda leaves okay wait you're really really sick okay here let's collect as much until this uh shears break which wow that i didn't even finish the sentence those are gone amaranth okay nice nice i thought that was a twitch streamer yep and there goes the pick or, i mean my axe but Okay, good. I got a sapling. God, that tree is so cool. Sure, let's just collect a lot of stuff. You know, maybe we can uh, use these for some cool looking bushes and areas. Oh my god gosh this, this entire area is so cool i got a whole lot of stuff to collect which this is when it gets to uh i hope i have enough space which speaking of space i need to upgrade my backpack to hopefully maximum which i think i can since i now have two diamonds but i also want multiple backpacks just because like i just as you can very clearly tell i just have a very big issue with looting stuff like i, I just love collecting everything I, I don't know why it's an actual problem but we have a whole lot of flowers i'm going to assume that a can make more of these flowers in the future so like i'm not really worried but i think if we use planters then we can actually use these in decorations maybe use them as like directions in buildings if i make them so massive that should be nice and pretty oh boy 
If you look at that mini map, oh no. Oh no, we're in trouble. It's the cherry blossoms. Hello, beautiful. Oh my, okay. So I'm hope. please don't break my ax, even though like it really doesn't mean anything to me, but please. Oh, oh God. Cut it in half and hello. Wow. Oh my God. That's so beautiful. <gasps> Wait, the leaves naturally fall from it. Oh, so we can get some nice like atmospheric blocks. Oh dear God. There's so much. Okay. Cherry blossoms are super massive. Noted. Oh no. Wait, I can actually craft bundles. <gasps> no, I didn't pick up any of those uh, leather pieces back at the village void because I actually kind of really want to use bundles now. That'll at least allow me to um uh, hold like a bit more. Actually, wait, no, no, no. Instead of making bundles, because it'd be the almost the exact same thing for uh, backpacks, maybe now, especially since I do have a lot of iron, we need to start making more backpacks. So, I just heard you. <gasps> Hi, Moo Moo. Yeah, I'm really sorry, guys. I, I, I just need the leather, you know? If there was some way that, like, you know, I could just extract the leather from you, but, like, without harming you, totally would. Most definitely would, but, um, yeah. Uh, I mean, okay, you guys are in luck. You don't give leather, you give something else. Oh god, hi. <gasps> Ooh, grapes. Yes. Come out, cows. I need my leather. It's a lot of bridges all in one spot. It's like kind of redundant. What? I could have sworn there was a cow over here. <gasps> there you are. You can't escape me. I'm gonna make that backpack. I need it so I can loot more. Yes, yes, there's so many up here. Yes. Hello. Hello. I swear I'm going to try not to take more than I need. Wow, you are really massive and kind of creepy. That That is really weird how big you are. Like, how do I only have four after killing so many of you? Please drop leather. Oh, no, they're not dropping leather. Please, thank you. Please, just a little bit more. I think I just need two more. Yeah, I just need two more leather. Please think about the future of your kind. You're hurting everyone in the future, not just yourself or me. Oh, God wait uh oh no there was like what eight cows up here and they dropped like four leather no oh my god i need one more wait we might actually be able to get lucky with those ruins usually for some reason they always have leather inside of those oh god wow okay let's not fall in there let's go take the long route uh i don't really want to run into those guys and you know oh my god oh jesus okay i almost just jumped off the cliff like an idiot but i don't want to get the uh the, the their curse you know especially if i go into another village really don't want to do a raid right now. Wow, or I can get really lucky and have absolutely nothing in that run. And they're kind of close. Okay, let's... Guys, let's just keep going this way for the map, which... I'm going to give this like an extra 30 minutes and then I'm just going to throw away this map because usually whenever I follow a treasure map... <gasps> Wait, white sand... Dacite. Oh, I want to use this for building. Okay, we actually really need to find some leather and then come back here. Oh, dude, I can actually build some nice stuff with that too. Please drop leather, please. I'm desperate at this point. I know you're not cows and this will make some people angry, but oh boy, I need the leather, please. If you if you don't, there we go. Thank you. It's like, if you don't, I'm just going to go to the next one. All righty, so we go here, make that, boom, make a chest, make sure it's an actual chest, beautiful, boom, you, backpack. Let's go ahead and load you up so I can actually put other things in my inventory. Okay, so we need iron and we need gold, so then we put iron around you, get a plated backpack, then we put gold around you. We got the gilded uh, backpack, which that's what I have right there. So yeah, we just really need to get some uh, more diamonds and emeralds and then I can upgrade these. They can even hold more. So now, very nice. I can actually fill up all of that so we can stay out here and loot even more. And then let's go back this direction. Luckily, didn't have to go that far. And here we go. Ah, beautiful. Allegedly, I have this back in my house, but uh, I, don't, I don't believe that. Since, like, nothing popped up about new recipes unlocking. But this looks really, really nice to build with. I think I can work with this in uh, diorite. And this would be the part that I would show you a time lapse of me collecting everything, but I can't have the replay mod on this uh, mod pack. So I'll see you guys in, like, 20 minutes or something. Maybe 30. So it's been a little bit and um, whoop, the land is now transformed. So I collected nine stacks of that dacite. And then there was another fun block in here, which was really surprisingly fast to collect, uh, white sand. 
which I like I don't know if like if I smelt it I'll get white glass but it's another white block that I can build with and make some patterns with but I'm pretty happy with all of those and I still have some uh storage so you know we can still run around try to find some stuff I just I feel like I'm missing something like there there's one thing that's gonna really tie the entire build together and I just I haven't found it yet because to recap I think a majority of like a white building with red adjacent blocks would look really cool for a beehive area like it's, it's just something new to build you know oh yeah and uh looking at this given how I'm, I'm pretty sure i have now traveled around 2000 3000 blocks with this map and i still have not found or even moved anywhere on this map like it hasn't budged and i'm very positive i like i am going the right way so i I think I'm honestly good with not like searching for uh, any of this anymore. So yeah, we'll just leave that there. Hello, so mahogany leaves. Don't care about that, but what are you? Green mushroom block, huh? Wait, if I break you, you drop anything? Okay, well you drop green mushroom. Sapling patterns? Do I have to actually like uh, plant these in an X formation? Or what if I break you here? Does it all drop? Of course not, okay. Uh. I can make shears, but I think I'd rather just grow this at my base and then just, you know, harvest it there instead of uh, taking up more inventory space with all these. And with 29 green mushrooms, I'll be very surprised if I can't get any of them to, to grow. And since we're here, oh my gosh, look at this entire red biome that we're going into. Oh boy. Okay, so red maple, and then this is mahogany. So it looks like it gives kind of like a light pink for the log. I swear I have mahogany back in my house though. So I don't think I need to collect any of this. I just kind of really want to get up. Let's see. Are you the Jacardi tree? Let's see. Yep, you are. Okay, good, good. Already have that tree. Maybe I can... No. I mean, purple's kind of close to red for, like, building-wise. Eh. I'm going to try and restrict myself and still make it look really cool. Why is there random bamboo? One thing that would help out. So, I love these, but I would really like to find a red one. Which, I mean, surely there has to be some kind of, like, a red bush. Saplings, which, uh, I guess that's cool enough. Uh, oh, hi! No, don't blow up, don't blow up, don't blow up. What are you, Mario? What up? Uh, sure, I'll collect you, why not? You really don't need to follow me. Like, you're not hidden whatsoever. Like, you kind of stand out like a sore thumb and I'm going to blow you up. Oh my God. Just die. Just die. Just die. Thank you. Okay, so there's another red forest over in this direction. We should probably go check that out. I'm almost tempted to build a third backpack, but I also kind of want to wait until I can max out these backpacks because like, maybe I'll be good on uh, inventory space then. Because I feel like it's a little cheaty to have so many backpacks, but I really don't think it matters like I don't, I don't think like any of you care if i have a lot of backpacks it really feels like i'm on an, like an alien planet oh man more purple ones again love you guys totally gonna be using you in some building or at least a room but like man i would love a red one come on red bush oh hi really random spot for you to be in actually okay since there's so many of you here let's collect a lot of you Wait, you're actually different from this one? Gotcha, very interesting. You're not lightning, right? You're just rain that won't leave me alone? Wow. Oh my gosh, you look so cool. Whoa. Oh, amazing. Okay, ah, eh, screw it. Let's keep going this way. Maybe we can find some other red blocks. I'm curious why these grass blocks are red. God, I would love to build with them. Ugh, I wish I knew how to do more stuff in this mod pack. Why can I not land my water buckets anymore? Here, can I land this one? Okay, there we go. Okay, phew, I'm not a complete loser just yet. Ooh, nice and spooky looking area. I mean, technically, I can have multiple houses. Oh my god, this area is actually really cool. Oh my gosh, this would be such a cool area to build. Because I mean, oh, oh, that's a nice entrance. Wait, what if I just leave a waste stone here? Because I, I do have three. I could leave a waste stone here and name it like Dark Forest Home or Black Forest Home because it's a lot of ebony trees around here. And then this could be like our mining outpost. Oh, wait, I kind of like that. Then we don't need a, like a mining outpost at our actual house. <gasps> That's 4,000 blocks away. <gasps> I like that idea. Okay, we'll leave you here. There you go. Black forest home. Beautiful. And honestly, here, since we have the opportunity, let's just go back home. Where my bees? Okay, good. 
Why is there only two of you? Where's the third? Oh my God, where did the third one go? Wait, what? Oh God, they're all, they all changed. Oh God. So I'm guessing it's fall or maybe winter now. Oh wow, okay. That, oh God, it like ruined the aesthetic of the building. There's like no color now. Wait, what happened to my third B? There's no way it got downstairs, right? And then like figured out about the uh, the pressure plates. Uh, oh my God, but did I just say it's outside? How did you get all the way outside? Move, move, get away from that move. Hurry, hurry, hurry. I need to go kidnap the B again. No, it's getting a taste for freedom. Ow, it's going to escape. Get back here. Come back here, Bumble. Come here. Please come here. Come here. Why? Yes, 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 yes. Perfect, perfect. Thank you. Well, I guess it's a really good thing that I came home. I wonder if me teleporting home somehow made the bee like render outside instead of in the building somehow. But yeah, there shouldn't be any holes in here. So yeah, all of you get away from the, stop going to ladder. Just away from the, away from the ladder. Oh God. Okay, well that's scary, but they should be staying up there. Oh my. Uh, anyways, here, we're gonna take several chests and well, we're gonna do, with everything that we just got before I fall to my death. So we'll just go up here. We're gonna leave the chest right here since this is where we're gonna be building. Ah, all organized and ready to go. And while getting organized and thinking about this place, imagine like a nice mega build specifically right here where it looks like a giant like drill. Like I forgot the name of it, but it's the largest vehicle in the world where it's at like actual mine sites. It's like a giant wheel, you know? Like what if I build one of those like right here so it looks like we're actually like digging our way down. I can make multiple buildings around here. Make this look entirely like a mining uh, district. Like I think that would be a lot of fun. And then, you know, we just always come down here uh, whenever I need to go mining and or, like, get like ores, or whatever, maybe even like stone. So then slowly over time, like as the episodes go on, it just looks like this place is, you know, making more progress with the uh, mining, you know, like you, you can actually see like the area age, which might be fun. Go, boom, disable it so I don't see it, and good. Okay, so area's marked off. We're never uh, gonna lose this place. Uh, tell me down below if you guys are into, you know, seeing that idea for the mining outpost. It would definitely take multiple episodes to make it because, like, I kind of want to make everything big over here. Oh, God. And it looks like we're going to be under attack the entire time so we'll have to construct some walls okay let's not aggravate them because i would rather them stay near their uh, tower instead of wandering over here <gasps> oh we've been milk cat mushroom you might go well with the red okay wait let me uh, let's go ahead and uh, collect a little bit of it oh god please give me one mushroom please please ready please oh god uh okay we got one we just saw it drop Oh my god, hi, Jesus. Oh my god, hi, dog. God, I w why did that freak me out so much? I thought it was like a, I honestly thought it was a skeleton on all fours just running at me. Like, oh my god, that was terrifying. Love you, dog. Wow, you're so amazing. <gasps> Ooh, and we have a ravine. Actually, a really decent sized ravine right next to the mining outpost. Luckily, we don't actually have to build everything together. So, hey, maybe if I find more biomes that kind of just like speak to me, you know, and I just, I think I can build something really dope in them you know we'll just have houses everywhere as long as we have a waystone to it wait am i crazy or did i not lose any xp from traveling back and forth to my base oh god don't touch me pumba kuna matata it means don't touch me and let me on with my way something 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 Ooh, hello okay let's see uh i feel like i don't know i feel like i should collect the torches on this village i kind of really don't care to keep this one um desert villages are like cool and all but eh, i don't exactly care to keep them all okay luckily i do have all this stuff don't care we can stay light don't need to be looting so much okay do you guys not have any torches have i looted this place before oh see now we're talking hello waystone beautiful thank you so much i'll be taking that because i'm sure you can craft waystones but it's just so much more fulfilling using waystones that i I know that I've stolen from a village. <gasps> no, I love this village. Oh no. Gosh, I want to keep you guys so badly. Uh, okay, maybe there's a mod that I can put in here. Well, let me like put them in my inventory or something. Like there has to be some way that I can take these guys home with me. Or right, is this how you make an iron, or not an iron, but a copper golem? Like, do I just need to have like a copper block on bottom like that and then just a 
carved pumpkin on top? Because even though I have no idea what they do, I really... Ooh, nice. Ooh. Really want to keep them. Or not keep them, but I just want to have some in my base. Like, I, I won't do anything with them at all. I just love how they look. Which, hello? You're interesting. I can make this. Okay, wait. I, I can make... I can make this. I can make this. I can make this. This one. There we go. See, I told you first try. Am I going crazy? What was that? Is there like a micro bee after me? One of like the African killer bees or whatever they're called. Like the super deadly ones that hate humans. Oh, I can totally make this jump. I can totally make him get the torches. Yes. Oh yeah, that's right. Mm, I like to risk my life for four torches. What can I say? I can, can I make it back? Yes, I can. Okay, I think I've looted the village pretty decently. I, oh my God, I actually made that. Okay. I don't think there's anything left here for me, so we'll just continue on. And just like that, I didn't touch these two buildings. Hello? Okay, so a whole lot of orange around here. So maybe in this biome kind of area, there has to be like some kind of red blocks. Like I'm kind of shocked just how rare, like how scarce uh, the color red is in Minecraft. Very clearly, a lot of people do not care to like dive into that uh, department. Mm, nothing over there. So maybe a lot of the uh, the color red will be coming from the cherry trees that I have back in my house. Because luckily I did see a lot of those in my uh, chest. Which one of these days I need to make an automatic sorting system, but I'm, oh God, I'm scared to get into that. Since this is modded, there's so many more blocks to do. That by itself will be a mega build. Like, not even by choice. It's just because of how massive I'll have to make it to store all of the items that I want. But I'm down for the challenge. And hello, I am down to loot this uh, village. Now, since I don't care about this village, I want to test something. So I like the bounty boards and it would be kind of fun to like dive into this realm, you know, and uh, become like a bounty hunter for like an hour or two, see how much I can do. What happens if I break you? which I, I don't think I'm gonna be able to collect it with how long this is taking. Quest completed, craft a bounty board. Well, I didn't craft you, but how are you? So if I place you back down, you have the exact same ones. Okay, okay so that's cool. So any other village that I go to, honestly, oh, and back at our normal village, we might as well just pick up every single bounty board and then just put them all into the same spot. Like we can just go and build a, uh, a building for the bounty boards, which might be a good idea, especially since then we can actually uh, focus all of them a lot faster and I won't have to run around so much looking for new bounties. Ooh, and then for one of the bounty boards, we can place it in like a special spot that stands out and then that's the one that we turn in everything to. Corn cob, hell, wait, what? Kernels, back in my house, wait, but I, I have, okay, wait, I have two emeralds that I, uh, got by means that none of you need to know but here i'll just buy one of you that was the first time i ever bought something from a villager in this world huh nice i don't know why uh you two are in here there was a third but he seemed to have yeah he ran away but um yeah i'm i'm the one sleeping in the bed tonight okay it's very lovely just want to stay on top of all the farming stuff so whenever i actually start then we'll have every single thing that we'll need to make really nummy dishes as just before i dive into the farming like side of this mod pack i just i really want to build a nice building for it so we'll see how far we get into here pretty soon i will return back home to actually build the beehive area and then we'll start working on uh, villagers because ultimately i think it'll be wisest to actually work on our armor and tools get all those maxed out and then we'll start the like super duper fun uh farming stuff oh you guys are so kind you have a free waystone for me here oh my god Gosh, dude, you guys just want to make me blush. I've also just realized that uh, you guys have a graveyard and a haunted building in your village. Kind of interesting, you know, uh, interesting choices to have, like, literally in your village. Especially since they can spawn in enemies. Uh, do you guys happen to have anything good in this? Kind? Oh, silk touch. Oh, nice. Okay, I can put that on one of my picks. Knockback, fire protection one. Eh, I'm okay, I'll let you guys keep that. Really don't care for bones. I have so many. Oh, I will take the candle uh don't need hoofty i can get something higher than that thorns one and eh, i need thorns three or at least two actually no i need thorns two i think or do i need thorns three i forgot boss protection one more useless stuff sharpness one piercing one okay so it looks like i got everything useful out of here Ooh. 
Actually, I missed you. And collection. Tools automatically pick up drops? Huh? Okay, the way that's amazing. I most definitely need that on at least my picks. Oh no, actually, especially the axe. Imagine with that. Oh my gosh. Wait, what if I put that on my sword? I wonder if it would like automatically pick up um drops from mobs. Okay, I, I like that graveyard. Never mind. I see why you guys kept it here. Please continue making more. Look at the C1. Eh. I mean, it's a cool looking book, but I'm fine. Beautiful. Inside the building, you guys have nice more glowstone loyalty three. I would like to get a trident. And honestly, yeah, let's steal the luck turns because I am going to be needing a like a metric ton of those. Um, I don't think like I need to like search around though. Like, I don't think there's any hidden passageways in these chapels. I'm pretty sure they're just for aesthetic. And yep, that's the vibe that I'm getting right now. Okay, beautiful. Trust me, I am trying so so hard to not loot places like it's just it's just so tempting there's just so many good things you know well you're kidding i can wait, so there's there can be beekeeper villagers and if i just give them flowers i get emeralds okay so i guess i should make a beehive job block for one of the villagers that might be like a pretty crazy easy emerald farm to have but i digress uh let, let's let's continue on Ooh. Ooh, hello, you. Let's see, are you cobblestone or are you iron? You know, I don't want to make that same mistake before. This isn't coal, is it? Oh my God, it's all coal. Hello. Oh my God, hello. Oh God, yes. Oh, I just love you. Yes, please. More, more, more. Jeez, 14 blocks of that. Yeah, I'm happy. Thank you. And that wasn't even the loot spots. Let's see, you got anything good up here for me? Let's see. More tomatoes. I'll take the onions. Why not? Nothing else. Okay, that was a very interesting uh, outpost. And I could have sworn they always had like like way nicer stuff on them. Oh my god. Oh, Jesus. Oh my god. Very luckily there's water down there. Oh my. Wow. That. Okay, I wasn't paying attention to that. I need to stop looking at my other monitors and watching videos. Dear god. This place would love to kill me. You're not from a dragon, right? Please tell me this started from lava. Okay, that makes me really uh, nervous. That did not start from lava. Uh, let's most definitely just get out of here. We uh, really need to haul it out of here moss blocks why do i hear flapping Dude, am i going insane in here i swear to god i was hearing flapping okay here uh before we go anywhere i don't think i have any moss blocks but i do know how to create more of them so i'd like at least just six of those something out of it oh damn. okay if i had a hoe i could go faster cracked mud oh jesus hi nope don't touch me uh, am I in a wooden prison or something? What are these trees? It's like a spider or something like tickled the leg of a tree and it got scared and immediately stood up. I swear to God, I keep hearing like wings flapping. Okay. Uh, okay. That's just grass. That's just cypress leaves. Huh. No way. Wait, 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 wait. Oh my God. Oh, Jesus. Oh God. I did not want to fall down there. Oh. Ooh, wait, you might also be really nice to build with since you are red. Okay, got a few of these. But yeah, you might be nice to build with, especially since you're white and red. So at least I get, you know, the two colors that I want to build with. But that's not the exciting part. So you'll notice that there's a uh, frog noises going on right now. Ooh, and there's lily pads. Mm, don't mind if I do, especially if- I Oh my gosh, wait, this is a green one. <gasps> Ooh, there's green logs. Oh my Jesus! God! Don't hurt the frog! Okay. There, it wasn't me, please don't eat me. But what I was talking about with all of uh, the lily pads, which I got right here, which I'm pretty sure I can use bone mail on them to get more. So like, I don't need to collect so many of them. But where did he go? There's a frog here which okay good i can't pick him up oh wait here you go so there's these two frogs which i won't lie i don't know how to breed frogs at all like i've almost have never like dived into that part of uh, minecraft like I, I haven't really played around with like those new updates before but if i can get them to breed they can make some uh um tadpoles and then from the tadpoles we can actually get frogs can i harvest you at all because i would actually really appreciate it if i could build with some green wood please just give me a sapling please any sapling thank you 
Okay, and it looks like I need four of these guys, and then I have to place them in, like, specific areas to grow. Like, it looks like just one sapling won't grow the tree. Just a little interesting. Why does this tree not drop saplings, please? Beautiful. Okay, now we can actually use that tree for building when we want to. Um, this entire time, like, mm, how do... How does one breed frogs? Like, I don't even know what they would want to eat. Like, what, you want, like, a steak? Like... Should I go get some, like, Wagyu beef for them? Should, let me actually look that up. Oh, God, it takes slime. Ah, uh, well, I gotta be honest. Uh, I don't have any slime, and I will not be, you know, looking around for any slime for you guys. Wait, I, I can actually take these? Oh, okay, wait, this is actually kind of cool. So, yeah, uh, we're not gonna have any frogs for now. Uh, maybe in the future I'll uh, work on actually getting some, but I'm um, just really... Wow. Really can't be bothered right now with doing that. And I think our adventuring is coming to an end. I think I've explored enough and honestly, we'll just have to use uh, everything back in my base for a build for the bees. Um, if anything, I'll have to use, you know, like some of my traditional blocks that I always use. And hello. Oh dear God. Wow. Okay. Hi. Wow. That's so cute. You have like a double building over here like a little mansion for yourself that's so adorable I i'm gonna come in and loot you see if there's anything for me to steal i don't know if you're trying to tell me to like stay out or not but man i'm, <laughs> I'm really not feeling welcomed out here wow all of that looks really bad okay oh where is the witch oh where is the witch please don't jump out at me don't 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 just heal just heal yourself thank you Oh, thank you, finally. A witch fight where they don't hurt me. Uh, potion of luck. Cool. I don't know what luck is used for in this game, but sure. Ooh, potion of invisibility. You might actually become useful in the future. And instant health, glycerin, watermelon. Okay, and I am starting to get done. I think we've traveled around enough. Uh, I just want to check out the biome right in front of me, and then after that, we'll head back home. What are you? Oh, more snails. <gasps> Wait, don't snails drop slime? No, they still drop nothing. What is the point of, uh, snails? Like, I really don't get them. You would think that they would drop slime. Like, I'm not crazy, right? Like, I feel like it would make sense for snails to drop slime. Is there a tornado forming or something? Am I about to die? Actually, just so I don't lose a waystone, I... I don't want to find a village. If I can find another village with a waste stone in it, then we'll use that to get back home. Because I'm kind of greedy, and I really don't feel like leaving one of my four waste stones out in the middle of nowhere. <gasps> oh, and we have more red stuff, but I'm pretty sure... Okay, so that's just regular oak. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to be finding anything else. So I think we've come across all red blocks. At least, like, all the easy-to-find ones. Hello? There's apparently bees right here. Oh, hello. I just really want a village, really wish you would just pop out. Really want to go back home, but I'm so stingy that I don't want to use any of my resources. Ooh, did I just find a bee biome? There sure is a lot over here. Wow. Another thing that I'm realizing as I'm going through, like, all of these new chunks and, you know, and just trying to find some building blocks i haven't seen one dungeon at all like still to this day this is the only dungeon and like mushroom stuff on this entire world that i've been through like i i really don't get it like i don't know if i'm just that unlucky or lucky however you like you want to look at it but i just i have not found anything <laughs> And I really feel like maybe it's the mod pack. Like maybe I need to like update it to a new one and then see if I could transfer this world to like a different better Minecraft mod pack. But like this, this is starting to seem like really bad. Like I feel like there's something wrong with my mod pack. Cause there's no way they're supposed to be this rare, right? Like very surely there's supposed to be way more dungeons. Ooh, pumpkins. Uh, I might have some back at home, but if I want to make some copper golems, I want to, you know, be positive that I have uh, some pumpkins for it. Boy, coming up on another red biome. Oh, what are you? 
Okay, I think that's nothing, but we might find some nice loot in there. Oh, please have some lovely loot that I can steal. Well, I'm not seeing any iron. I'm very positive this is all cobblestone uh, inside. Very yeah, nice. I'll take your onions. Why not? Oh, these might be some nice trees. So, I mean, okay, I know it's not red, but it's orange. And it might be close enough. Or are you only looking like this because of the time of the year? Acacia leaves? Uh, I always thought that they were green. So it might just be because of the time of the year. Here, one way to tell is if we get the sapling. If the sapling is orange, yeah, it's green. Yeah. Yep. So no, these are actually just green leaves. It's just because of the time of the year. No, <gasps> no way. It's the cool mob. It's it's the mauler. No way. Oh my dude. I want to have one of these in my house so badly. Oh my God. They're so cute. <gasps> Ooh, and that's even cuter. What was, what did you just do? Oh wow. You sound really interesting. Go ahead. But uh, hold up. Uh, I have no self-control. I need to go loot that. Why, hello there, villager. You wouldn't happen to have a waystone on this thing, would you? No, but you do have 11 iron and an unbreaking three and deep fry, which cooks certain fish fishing rod i don't know how you have rock cod then but uh yo thank you so much and uh i don't think you'll need this you know i don't think anything will spawn on here or bug you so um hey thank you very much for all of that oh we should also build like a really nice fishing spot definitely would be a fun little build to get into i think i can make that look very beautiful oh we could probably have like like a small sorting system with like all the stuff that i pick up as well from fishing because maybe Maybe, you know, we don't need to have like one massive storage system. Maybe we just have like multiple auto sorting systems, you know? Yeah. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I see you. I just saw those copper golems and hello village. Oh God, please, don't hurt me. Do not hurt me. Just leave me alone. Do not chase me. I will kill you. It's night time. Please have a bed for me to steal. Three bees in there. Okay, well, I'll leave that. Okay, are you guys just allergic to beds in this village? How do you guys sleep? Oh, hello. Like seriously, where are your beds? Oh dear God, fine. I'll use my own. Okay, beautiful. I'm still going to be stealing every single thing from your village, but I'll leave this waystone. Probably won't come back to it. Actually, no, no, no. Since we are uh, 7,000 blocks away from home, so this might be a good waystone to go to whenever we just want to get far away from our base. Okay, beautiful. The one nice thing about this place, though, is that it is in a red biome village. So even though I keep talking about, you know, red, at least we can teleport back here if we ever need anything. And there seems to be a cherry blossom uh, forest right next to this place. So cute. So hello, beautiful. I Zola Leffy. Zo Zo Zoli Leffy. Sure, I'll call it that. Why not? Okay, so this is gonna be the red forest ville. Yeah, we'll just call it ville. I'll, I'll know what that means. Okay, beautiful. And now we can go back home, please. Okay, one, two, three. Okay. Okay, beautiful. You three are still up here. Oh dear God, please get away from the ladder. Get away from it. Don't come down. Don't come down. Okay, beautiful. I think we're safe. And now I just have the super duper fun job of getting organized. Okay, everything is put away. We're all clean. And I think I'm ready to build. Now, firstly, so we're going to be building a staircase going up to there. So I'm going to want this to match with, you know, the design down here, which I really wish that it was some other season. So the leaves weren't brown. And I don't know. Oh God, this might be interesting to build with. However, while I am building the bridge, I kind of don't really have that much wood. And and so far, that's only the cherry. What happened to the other one that I got? <laughs> oh, where did I put you? Also, is it nighttime? Oh, it's nighttime. Yeah, but no, 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 no. Go, 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 go. There we go. Okay, good. Phew. Oh, yeah. While I was getting organized, yeah, one of them actually did come down here. So, yeah, they're getting a little antsy. Uh, we, we do actually need to hurry up on their home. Okay, yeah, so it was maple, and I think that's it, really. I mean, I do have, like, this cherry log stuff, so here, we might as well bring that with us. Oh, beautiful. So, it doesn't matter to me, like, oh, no, it's gonna take longer to grow this season. Wow, would you look at that? I have two stacks of bones. So, we can at least now start uh, growing all of the trees. But I don't think I'll be needing that much red stuff because off of the top of my old cherry log. Wait, this ages? Oh no, it's two different things. Okay, interesting. Old. Really? Like it, it can age? Like, wait, if I break like any of the blocks over here, is it going to say that it's old as well? That's actually kind of interesting. That's a little bizarre to me. Anyways, so out here, no point you there and there. I 
God, from memory, these were actually huge. Wait, no, don't I need to put you in a certain pattern? I think we should be fine to just spam these everywhere. Just want to make sure they all have a lot of room to grow. Beautiful. And then and then for the mushrooms. So, God, um, okay. Maybe we aren't going to be building with mushroom. Oh, no. Wait, I think I have to build it in here, huh? Yeah, because I can actually place it there. Okay, here. If I use bone meal on you, I kind of... Okay, I, I'm, I'm losing interest and building with a red mushroom like as the milliseconds go by so maybe we don't use that because we do have we have a decent amount of red stuff uh, majority of the build is going to be white so i think I think I'm fine. I guess first, let's go and use up all oh, the bone meal. Okay, didn't mean to do that. Beautiful. Man, I don't know what the sapling was talking about. That didn't take long to grow at all this season. Okay, but I'm not going crazy, right? When I got the cherry leaves, weren't they red? I thought that's why I picked up this log. Or maybe they were always green, but I got the log because I knew it was red. I feel like I'm going insane. I swear the leaves of this used to be red. Also, before I even start harvesting them, especially with that tree right there. Oh my god, I'm in love with that one. Um, No, 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 no. Get down here. Get down here right now. Let me pick you up right now. No. Okay, good. You guys are still up here. Get away from the stupid ladder. Dear God. Okay, we need to hurry. Or at least build like some kind of containment unit for them so that they stop trying to go down the ladder. Okay, but anyway, so I need uh, shears so I can collect a lot of the leaves from you, which very luckily it looks like they'll stay red. So we never have to worry about the season that we're in. You know, our build will always stay red with these. And okay, good. I can harvest that with one touch oh yeah i definitely need that one enchantment on my axe where it just picks up everything after i chop it down that is most definitely a must um since it looks like i'll be needing quite a few of these dear god how many holes are there on this mountain why is that surprising to me that i get cherries from that okay so not too bad off of all of the bone meal that i used to get like that amount of logs but seeing how this actually gives i mean well other than wood but you know it gives me some red leaves to work with so i think i'm just gonna grow all of these saplings with bone meal and then once that's done i'll just plant the saplings again and then i'm just gonna save the bone meal for all of the trees that are like that i direly need where where's the rest of them i swear i put down seven i feel like i'm going insane in this world dude this world is gaslighting me so much and it's actually working okay wait wait here we go okay. place some of you up here there we go okay beautiful take up some of these that i can reach god i really wish these trees weren't so tall ah, so this is what you five foot tall people uh, it's like for you in the world crazy and just like that oh yeah let's switch right are you beautiful just like that my god okay so i have like four and almost a half stacks of the red oak leaves uh you know i got some cherry logs and we got a whole lot of oak logs so i think the passageway up to here is going to be using a lot of wood which maybe in the future i mean it's going to be like really pointless but man maybe like a cobblestone farm might be really nice just really wish that i could make it automated um anyways so since i'm going to be building it around here we'll place some of the trees like all the way out here so that then none of these should uh conflict with my building wait oh that's red maple uh wait where did that sapling go wait, how did i get that interesting oh Wait, oh, I never planted any. Oh, yeah, probably should plant some of the cherry ones, given how I will be needing their wood. Alrighty, so everything sorted out. Now, okay, first off, obviously, I need to get rid of this and this. Give me that back. And I guess we can keep it kind of a tight fit, so I should know. So we need to pick up all three of these, get all of this stuff again. And okay, so maybe for this, just for, like, God, I hate it with the seasons. I'm not going to lie. So just to break it up during the seasons here, we'll use some stone, which the stone can then lead into regular log. Um, okay, maybe regular logs. Like, I 
guess that's fine. And then on all of the sides, maybe we can then line this up with regular logs. And then instead of using staircases, especially since I didn't bring any, uh, maybe this is when we just start making a staircase out of just regular slabs. Make it look like, you know, a little bit more effort went into it. Which we then line up with more logs. And so far, I'm running with this. So I'm trying to just break up some of the gray coloring with like just regular planks. I might go back and replace that with regular logs because I feel like that's too much with having just planks on the side and then planks right there, which is luckily a very easy fix. Boom. Bop. Yes. Yes. I like that way more. I just wish that these were green. I just trust me. It's going to look really good once we're out of fall. I think we're in right now. Ta-da. This entire thing very perfectly matched up. I, I wish I could say that I calculated this entire thing and I purposely built all of the spacing so it would match up with the land up here, uh, but I didn't. Yeah, just like all of my other building, it, it was accidental. I, I never actually plan out anything. But our passageway up here is perfect. However, this is not where I'm going to be building, uh, you know, the beehive area. Um, I actually want to put it a little bit up, but I'm not going to do any terraforming. Uh, lately, I've been enjoying building with the land. So, you know, we'll just build like some stilts coming up on a building and, you know, and then, then we'll build it that way. Um, the hard part now, actually, no, no. Okay. We need to go back and we need to finish up the bridge before I go and do anything else. So I think honestly, it's just going to be a super easy thing. You know, we just go by with just some uh, oak leaves like this. You know? I'm going to slap these right here. Boom, boom. So also hopefully, you know, keep any enemies that uh, spawn on the mountains or anything. Like if there's a skeleton, hopefully this will just prevent them from shooting me. Maybe, probably not. And then uh, I only have three, but um, yeah, I want to put down trap doors as well. I, think, I don't know. I just, I think that'll be a nice fit. Or maybe we put it on top. Oh, maybe on top. Yes, yes. A nice sandwich look. Yeah, yeah. I think I like that more. Okay, so I actually really like this. I feel like this needs more. Like maybe on the back side, we put uh, oak signs maybe on all the leaves. Might actually look really nice. I won't lie. Oh, I'm also really tempted to swap these out for stairs. Now looking at this, like especially when I'm down here or something and I'm looking up at the bridge. Oh yeah, no, I think we need a lot of stairs. Maybe a few more slabs just to smooth it out. Nah, nah we don't have to go that crazy. But I, I actually think that having some stairs where the, uh, the planks are would actually make it look a lot better from the ground. Which, hey, lucky me, I can actually easily make it right here. So here, we'll, we'll start out with 12. Let's just see what it looks like on one side. And with this entire side completely finished. Okay, I missed it. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I really like that. I think that looks so much better and so much cleaner than this side over here. Like, this to me, this just looks unfinished. This looks sloppy and unfinished. And this just looks so beautiful. Ah, uh, like, it also just hides, like, the bottom part pretty decently as well. Like, you don't really notice. And you have, like, the super blocky areas that don't have, like, a nice smooth finish. And that's why we need to turn this spot from this into this. This. And luckily, that actually didn't take that long whatsoever, but I'm happy with that. The only thing that I want to add now is some kind of support, at least right here. So if we just go here, add logs going all the way down, bring it into the water, just like that. And then maybe for the water part, I want to strip it. No, I think we need to use darker logs just to like indicate that, you know, it's underwater, you know, it's getting moldy, sucking up water. You yeah, it, it would look different. I am super tempted. I think it'll look good. You know, if we add some logs right here as well, like that. I think that's nice. Uh, we need to sleep. Oh, for the love of God, be regular rain, not thunder. Wait, no, 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 no. I do not want anything struck. Yeah, nope, I'm, I'm okay. Nope, nope, no, 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 no. Okay, so yeah, we need to work on lighting before moving on, which I think it'll actually look really nice if we just put lanterns at like every single log section like that. Because I don't care if it's wasteful or, you know, oh, it's not optimized enough for lighting. I'm, I'm wasting lanterns. Like, I don't really care for that, so... I like this. I like the aesthetic of that. It's nice and bright, so nothing should spawn down here, which, you know, I still very greatly care about. And then, since I didn't put any uh, trap doors on top of the leaves out here, except for the roof, I like this because I feel like it just naturally will, like, tell you, like, hey, you're going to a different part of the base. Like, this is leading you to a different area. So I do love that. I just... Mm, I really feel like I should add something else. Like, I really... Like, 
like starting here and then going on to the outside, I think oat signs would look really good right here. If you want to leave a comment, again, just imagine the leaves green, not brown, because that's what I'm kind of basing it off of, like, for my ideas. I think, honestly, I, I just want to see uh, all of your ideas. You know, I'm just oak signs on the outside of the bridge going up to the beehive. You, you say something like that, like, yes, you like it or no, you don't. Just to save on time, like, I, I just won't do it, just in case if, like, none of you like that. Also, do you guys have, like, another surprise baby in here that I am still a little confused on how you got? Wait, is there an extra duck? Oh, now there is. Okay, I'm sorry. Weeds? Yeah, new, new, new. That's kind of cool that they naturally grow in here like that. <gasps> eh, the baby panda grew up. Please. Oh, thank God. Yes, you're still sick. I mean, not not like that, but like, you know, you still have like the snot nose kind of a thing. Like, oh my. Oh, I'm so happy I have that panda. You have no idea. That thing is my my pride and joy. But we are still not done. Um, I have an idea with this. So like, it's cool that this goes up super duper high, but we didn't fix the lighting issue out here. And... I kind of want to actually get rid of this, but I think I want to keep the fences right there. Yeah. Um, anyways, so I have a lot of stone brick walls and maybe if we go onto the outside. So the only area where it would look nice is like directly right here, which, you know, yeah, it would add like some nice lighting specifically right here, but maybe every five blocks starting here so maybe this one this is when we do like one there one there and i want to make this like an archway every five blocks we'll have a stone wall going up so we're like one two three four and this is the fifth one so we'll start it here wow i hate that don't worry i, I will fix that um and then i'm choosing to do it on this block instead of this block right here because of the bamboo really don't want to get rid of it you know one two three four five so i guess on every six that's when we do all of that and then one two three four or, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll do another one up here. Perfect. Now, we need to come up with a general design for you. One thing that I want to play around with are moss blocks. So I have i don't think I've ever actually built with these, but I always collect them. So maybe, maybe we build it up like that and then like that? Maybe because then on the center one, boom, I could put down a lantern and I might like that. Uh, maybe we need to put some fences on top of the moss blocks and it might look better. Yep, this is really nice and convenient to get to. There we go. Maybe like that? Uh, do you need to be on top? Of that to look even better, maybe? Okay, wait. I, I'm actually starting to like this. Wait, wait, wait. That actually kind of worked. This is doing something to me. Yeah, no, no, no. Okay, so I don't really like that. Dear God, you fly at like Mach 27 speed. Yeah, so maybe that? Like, that's not bad. And it fixes our lighting issue. And it, it's a new it's a new thing I'm working on, you know? Like, if you saw the 50 hours in one block, uh, lucky block, not hardcore. But in that one, like, I'm trying out, like, building on top and, like, making archways and building in the sky so everything's not so open. So I think that's a... It's... I think that's a good look, you know, maybe. Um, For all of these floating parts, honestly, like, like a super duper easy fix, you know, just go and just like that. And I, I think that works perfectly fine. And I, I just, I mainly wanted to just fix the floating issue. Please tell me I don't need to go mining for a lot more. Oh boy. We might have to go mining for a whole lot more. Uh, well, might as well start cooking this. Oh, I really do not want to go mine. Oh God, not there. I really don't want to go mining. God, I hope I magically somehow have enough to finish you. No, no, I need one more. Oh no. Wait, 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 no, I, I am cooking some. Just please, I don't want to go mining. Oh, hi, you are not supposed to be there. Oh, I really don't want to go mining this movie, please. Yeah, there you go, beautiful. It's just, uh, even though I don't want to go mining, I can't like force myself to just not use stone blocks. I just, I need the, the gray color. Whoa, look at this nice red forest that we got going on out here. Ooh, love that. Yeah. And I actually really love this. There's some parts, like specifically this one, like you'll smack your head on it, but I really, really like that. I'm, I'm a fan of that. I just can't wait for fall to, to be over. Right, no, this has to be winter. No, fall. Yeah, because fall, winter, then you go spring, summer, right? Am I going crazy? Might have that backwards. Oh God, I look like an idiot now. Oh, whoops. I didn't add enough fences. But there we go. Now you're completed. Uh, now that it's starting to become nighttime, I think everything here is actually lit up enough. Maybe, maybe, Moving this one one block over might make it 
nicer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I think we need to move this one more over. That's really interesting. I don't know if you caught that. Um, That turned into mossy because of the, uh, the moss blocks right there. I actually was not expecting that at all. Oh, I, I don't like that. Oh, that's weird. Wait, maybe I do like that? Oh, that is really funky. Now, I don't mean to toot my own horn, but this right here is a nice bridge. And I think... I mean, in the future, I could add leaves on top of it, maybe. So we're just completely encased. So, like, you know, we don't see this guy at all. Might look nice. Might not look nice. Um, I'll leave that up to you guys. But another big thing about using moss blocks right here, which realizing it, like, it's going to turn all of these into moss uh like cobblestone moss walls it's just so it's always green uh, that's really the only uh decision i wonder if these only turn into moss stone blocks blah 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 um when it rains because i'm not seeing any of the other ones turn mossy and i wonder if it was just because it was raining but eh, anyways now we just need to make a pathway to where we want to build this building so one last little thing right before getting into uh making the pathway uh so right here i would rather have like a full block here's a cool looking modded thing kind of like i figured that you know this would be a little bit more fun to use instead of just like the regular uh chiseled stone block so maybe do something like that and then we just like mark it off like that um maybe something like that yeah yeah i know i think i definitely like the stone uh instead of a fence i think that's way way nicer okay beautiful nope never mind that's the exact same one that turned into a mossy one last time oh wait there we go okay yeah so those are just gonna slowly change over time now just to keep it natural maybe Maybe we just go around with this and then like we kind of just build our pathway. Like we kind of just like map it out a little bit. And then we'll keep a few of the uh, little grass things right there. I think like a nice three block wide pathway coming all the way down here. And then I think this is when we build kind of a staircase going up. So we need to get our logs back. And for this part, Wait, no, no, no. This is when we need to start building with the uh, our special blocks. So I think entrance should have... Oh, God. Which one do we use? Well, I'm pretty sure all of these trees are this block. Actually, let's go double check. I don't know which one to use. Wait, no, no. no. I think it's this one. What are you? Oh, no, you're not that. What are you? Okay, you're not this one. Okay, so you... Because I need to make sure that I use the correct cherry. Okay, so not that one, but we use this one. And I'm very curious, what is the difference? So here, we'll just put you there and you there. Do I actually have to worry about this over time? It even changes in red. That's actually kind of annoying, <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. I, I actually don't like that. Uh, unless there's a way to prevent it from aging, but... Um, I guess the old... We just turn into cherry planks then, I guess. So I'm going to use that for something. Uh, anyways, so for the staircase, we can actually just use diorite, I think. Okay, so with diorite... I think I'm a fan of just regular diorite. I don't think polish looks too good. So I got a few of those. And then in case if I need to make some walls, some of those. And then, yeah, we'll, we'll play around with this much. I don't want to uh, change too many into different blocks that I can't undo, just in case I don't like them. And so the edges... I think we make red. So this should be fine. Oh, God, never mind. Wait, I have to put you down here. So with this, we strip you. Oh, eh. I mean, it's kind of red. Oh, God. What are you? How does this one look? Well, I'll bite. Okay, so with this cherry wood. Oh, my gosh. Actually, I like that quite a bit more because I... It just kind of looks brown. It's like deep burgundy, and this is like kind of a like a vibrant red with deep burgundy. I don't know how to get you. I don't know where you came from. Dude, how did I collect so much of this and not have any of the saplings? Wait, no. Th what mod are you from? I, I, I have to have it. BYG. Oh, the biomes you'll go. Okay, so biomes you'll go. Surely I have the saplings for that one. Why is there only two of you? Crap, where did the third one go? Okay, somehow you're not in here. How do I have one escape artist who I don't even see on the mini map? No, no, no. Surely it has to be up here right eh, i have no idea where it went it, it could have suffocated itself as well and died no wait that's red maple never mind wait i don't think i planted you though did i actually not pick up any oh man i didn't pick up any of them oh that's so interesting oh hi it's cool i have 
five waste stones now. Okay, well, that sucks. Uh, so we just have to, you know, just suck it up and deal with it. So I am forced to use this one because I'm too lazy to go out and search for this one. So, oops. Okay. Well, since I have these other saplings, let's just go around and plant these two. And yeah, we need to start on the silver ones like that. Okay, so we'll let those grow and then we're going to do the super duper hard thinking of this. So first off, I think I'm going to kind of mirror how I did this because I do love this design for it. I do want to copy this uh, staircase because I love how, you know, it just comes up, wraps around. It's a nice tight fit, multiple different blocks in here. So you have so many things to look at. Uh, I also want to bring back the uh, the oak railings. So I just I like them. They're just so cute. So starting with you. So actually here we're gonna fully plan out our staircase. I know because I have to do this at the same time. So I'm liking how it's wrapping around right now, more, more like that. And I think I actually want to have it lead a little bit more over here. I would like to have the front door line up with directly with the bridge right here, because I think it would look a lot cooler. But I think I want to put the main entrance a little bit more to the right. So then the main entrance isn't directly in the center of the building. Maybe it's off to the side and then the building wraps a little bit more to the other direction. Just to give this like cool zigzag. Once we come over here, I go like boom, boom. Never mind, I talked myself out of it. So if we go like here to you to boom. Okay, wait, I think that's fine. So you come up around here, boom, boom, boom. And maybe, maybe just one more staircase right there. Boom. Okay. So I think the staircase is perfectly mapped out. And that was kind of the hard part. Not really. It was kind of like the easy part. Now for this part, need to go around with all of these logs, which that's going to be so much fun trying to figure all of this while making the top part look good, which basically that just comes down to a whole lot of placing and breaking. And this is one side done. I realize that like, yeah, this is kind of like a carbon copy of my staircase, even the direction of it going. Sorry. Hey, you know, don't fix perfection. Hey, <laughs> you know what they always say. <laughs> now, oh God. Uh, I really should have built this one over. Oh God. Wait, how did I do it before? Might have to do some tearing down and I really don't want to do any tearing down. Oh no, that's because I put a block. the issue is that, you know, if I start putting a block right here, well then boom, you're gonna be running into it. it just makes it extra tiny. Oh God. Okay, well, basically we just need to destroy this one side, luckily. And then we also have to go back, destroy all of this and perfect. So now we'll have a one block wide uh, gap. So we can actually put blocks there, not block ourselves off. Um, the other, Okay, so I think from there we can mirror it off. I mean, I would have loved if the step started here, but you know, it was planned differently, but eh. Oh, well, that shouldn't matter too much. I just don't want to like completely restart it. Okay, so let me break you. And then this ends not like that, like this coming up to that. And there we go. Okay, I think that's fixed. I'm a little shocked I didn't catch that while building it, but beautiful. Now, just to go back, finish off all of this. Okay, beautiful, except for you. Okay, there we go. So I think this is completely done. Like, I think all the placements are good. I'm happy about it. And then I stopped at a half block right here. So then I could put a whole block up here and then that'll finish off all of that. However, it's not red and now it all is. And this is actually starting to end up quite interesting. Uh, I think this is actually like a pretty fun color palette to work with. Uh, I won't lie. I kind of got it from uh, Destiny 2. You know, there, there's a specific DLC in there and you know, I, I just love the color palette of it. Now, the next thing that I want to add, which you know, is probably going to be really obvious, is going to be Red Lee. Oh my god, they're so much brighter and I did not mean to put you on that side. Uh, beautiful. So, we can go around with the red leaves, add in it on top of all of the logs. So now, we can't accidentally run off and possibly kill ourselves, even though it really doesn't matter. Beautiful. It's identical to my 
entrance at my home. But we need to work on adding in lighting. And I don't want to be lazy and just be like, oh, here's a lantern here. Oh, wait, you can't even add it. Okay, well, never mind. That kind of defeats the purpose of me talking. Um, well, I was going to say is like, you know, I don't want to be lazy and just put lanterns on top of all the leaves, which I probably could if I put like a slab or two. Actually, no, I'd have to put an entire block. Never mind. There are diorite walls, which we're going to basically just copy the bridge. Oh, God. Uh, never mind. Okay, we're going to add it here. And we're going to copy the bridge design just because like i just i like it so much of which i think just because we're going up so many stairs i think we go up four uh not do it like that so then in the center maybe down the center maybe this is when we use these because i'm not going to be uh using that many of them you know so maybe these logs we just bring across like that and then we can do that God, I hate this because it's it's even. I need it to be odd. Um. Okay, wait. I think I need to start playing around with this a little bit. No matter what, it's going to be even. Okay, that is annoying. Uh, an easy way to fix that would be using double the lanterns. So maybe I have to go five tall and then I just do that. It's just I don't want it right there because, you know, you smack your head on it. Or actually, no, it just traps you inside. So yeah, maybe we go up one more. That was cool. Those go across maybe like that? I guess that's fine. Here, maybe at the bottom. Just so it's not like so awkward and skinny. Maybe we do it like that? Oh, God. I don't know. Uh, I Oh, God. I really don't know. I would love to add stuff over top of this, but maybe this isn't how we do any of the uh, lighting on here. Yeah. No, I'm, I'm not a fan of this. I actually really hate that. I like the color combo of it. You know, at least got that going for me. But eh. wait, it's possible for lanterns to just break and delete themselves if I don't break them properly. Okay, that's good to know all right here uh give me a second i'm gonna do some off camera work see if i can actually figure this out because i feel like this is gonna take me forever okay i think i figured it out and we now have this so the way that i figured out on how like to you know do the lighting was to go to key points along the staircase and then just you know dig a hole out put the lantern there and then just cover it with logs everywhere so you're left with like these little parts that kind of just like jot out and you know, kind of an ice orb i then went around with even more leaves just to kind of help uh, hide all of those lantern spots just a little bit. I then also brought down the diorite slabs just to make it look even thicker and also just so you can see the white underneath the red like that. So hey, it's just more of just like depth stuff, you know, and like color things. And then all of the white is just on the ground and then the red is up top. And then uh, maple, it, it's kind of white. Like I know I can just use birch. And then it would like really be white up here, but I, okay, except for the diorite. I was just trying to use modded uh, blocks for this, you know, since you guys wanted to see me build with something else. So uh, that's why I went with those because I, I just haven't found anything brighter. But uh, next up, we actually need to clear out a forest of which I also really need to get organized. Don't you stay up there. I just, oh, God, I'm happy I just came in here to smack you back up. Um, yeah, I don't know if I said it, but yeah, we had a, a big, get lost so i only have two now I, I really don't remember if i ever showed that for the love of god please tell me that's a traveling villager and not a regular villager <gasps> oh but you're red Ooh, you're kind of cool Celia, ether sapling um maple what the bombs get wait isn't that the one i need wait 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 you might actually be useful wait a second wait no no because that's these trees okay gotcha yeah i'm so confused i don't know how i planted two of like very similar looking trees whatever but you know what that means i'm where did you go hello oh there you are i think oh you okay wait well, what happened to your lead wait oh okay he's still using a dog you are making this so confusing okay here just get rid of you i'm sorry I, I was expecting you to die a lot faster that was a little weird there we go beautiful two and three okay eh. honest I'll, I'll just leave the villager alive why not uh just please don't come up here to my house oh yeah and then at the beginning of this uh episode yeah i didn't need to make any leads because apparently i already had some i just completely forgot about them which seems to be on brand for this episode i just have so many worlds now to remember 
sure. Anywho, uh, which leaves were I using? Red oak leaves. Okay, so you, I definitely need more. So I do plan to use a whole lot of you in the build. Oh, these trees drop so much. Oh my God. Gosh, I can't wait until I get that enchantment so I don't have to run around everywhere like a headless chicken trying to pick up everything. That's right. Oh, dude, I totally forgot about the silver. Yeah, I think I can actually use a lot of these leaves for the build as well. I really wish that these trees weren't so tall. I feel so short, so difficult to like get all the leaves. <laughs> Man, is this how the rest of humanity feels? Like, I'm so happy I never had to like, deal with this. Okay. It's been a little bit, but I've cleared out, I think, enough space to actually build this building. And I don't think we need to make it that massive. You are toying with me. Was that a bee? Uh, I mean, is that? A, no, that's a firefly. Okay, never mind. You're not toying with me. Oh, that's cute. There has to be a way for me to tell what season it is. Surely this is fall, right? Like, dude, I feel like I'm going mentally insane in this mod pack. My God. Uh, anyway, so now for the important stuff. Trying to figure out a build design for this. And, um, oh, God, don't, don't fall. Just jump around. I kind of want to try out futuristic. I'm not going to lie. Whenever I think of, like, a building containing white, I just want to build it futuristic. Just because of all the sci-fi movies that I've watched over the years. It, it just, it feels so like futuristic. I'm almost tempted to make some form of the autoinator. I at least like take some kind of like, um, so what I'm talking about is like, you see like the, uh, the little ledge right here. So I'm thinking of making some kind of ledge like that. And then we have some white blocks. The issue, unless we go to the nether, which I'm like really terrified to do that, I won't lie. Uh, we don't really have any light blocks like that for me to use. And I really, really want to get that. I mean, we could probably go check out the nether and then maybe we can get glowstone in there and then, you know, we can just have like a nice easy time with it. You know, maybe there won't be any tough uh, enemies in there to try to kill me. Or we can also try out my shulker farm with this design where all of these, I could actually swap that out with lanterns. But this is what I mean whenever I talk about like a futuristic design and I just, you know, I have like a white block to build with. I, I just think of this like instantly in my mind just goes to this and I honestly think I might build a building relative to this size just for the storage system. Plus, you know, it's kind of fun having like a super big building like this and then having like a super big land and everything. So uh, yeah, it's just me like trying to like l literally show you what I want to build. So very obviously to build something of that. So I mean, I'm 100% I'm not doing that right now. We are nowhere near in game to actually do that. So hmm. Let's go look at the blocks again. So very obviously, I really want to build with these. Those look really fun. And we might be able to hide stuff relatively easy with these. Ooh, definitely want some of the white sand. We'll use up some of that and you. And here we go. So we have some kind of building pallet. Wait, can I even go to the nether? I don't, I mean, no, I, I can actually harvest uh, obsidian. Hmm, maybe, maybe we go to the nether in this episode, but I want to build a nice building for the portal. Anywho, so just to break it up, like the staircase to the platform, maybe this red block. Uh, let me just strip you. So at least with this one, so it's like a super bright red. I'm trying to think of how to do this if we don't want any doors. So if we don't want any doors, then we need to make like a, like a contraption to capture all the bees and keep them locked in. Since this will be the entrance to it, you come up here and I think we want to build something relatively large. Okay, well, I think no matter what, I want to use at least one block to kind of go around and just measure out the border of it. So we're going to do like this, this, and this. Cut back on these. So I think a three block, uh, so I think a three block border. So we'll come out to here and then this, goes this direction. I think relatively this size should be good. I mean, we don't need that many bees. Like again, this building is strictly for bees, maybe some other animals as well. I'm not sure yet, you know, might have a specific farm for them. Why do you go there? And while we might need to go chopping down that forest again, yeah, let's have you not touch my building. 
and there. Now, uh, yeah, this is definitely a lot bigger than I was expecting. You know, it's a nice way to ease back into a mega build. So it's like a 33 by, by 24. So, you know, it's a decent size. I, I can at least like really make stuff with this, but this is the outer layer. So we're not going to go past this whatsoever. Next up, God, I really want to go to the nether. Oh man, I really want to build with the uh, glowstone or at least shroom light. Then I would have to make a farm in there. Oh, God, but I um, I don't know, but I, I think it's, I think it would be a good decision to go into the nether. I really want some form of light block. Like I really don't want to use lanterns for this. I mean, surely there has to be some modded block in the overworld that emits light that I can use instead. I mean, there is redstone lanterns, which I only have eight redstone. So, you know, it'd be like, really unbelievably hard for me to actually do it. The bees are still here. Oh, that's cool. I have one bee left. Uh, what is going on? What's going on with all the bees? I, I'm so confused. Hey, please just stay in the house. I think I see where that bee went. I, I actually do my, my Terminator skills just turned on. I think I actually see where the bee is. You butthole. Get back here. You're not escaping. No. Not after I'm going to be building you an extravagant mansion to live in. Uh, uh no, you are. You are not escaping, buddy. Buddy boy bee thing. I don't know how you guys are houdining yourself out of here but yeah you can stay right there buddy god i want to harvest that wood but i really want those leaves uh okay let's go make some space and get some more of those leaves because i still feel like i'm definitely going to be wanting to use a whole lot of them oh beautiful at least i don't have to travel far to get up here to you know harvest some leaves oh lovely I mean, you know, might even be able to just leave this here and wow look i already have some of the floor done done with all those shears time for that and yep that's gone as well okay time for that okay beautiful Beautiful. Now we can actually do stuff. Well, I really want to use some kind of light block, uh, but I think I can just, I, I, I can keep building without it yet. You know, I can plan out all the other stuff. I really don't think I'm going to be able to finish this entire thing this episode. Really sorry to say that, but what I have in store for this building is just, I, I want to make it very nice. I want to make it big. I want to do like a massive building again, even though this really isn't massive. It's like, I, I just kind of miss it. Like I, I miss building like that. For the lip out here, we want it to be a little bit pointy. So we're not going to build below this and Instead, we will put a block here and then below it, we'll put leaves. So the reason why we're using leaves right here is because if I can actually get a light block, the leaf down below it, boom, the light can shine through. It'll light up uh, below the base a little bit, make it look more futuristic, make it all shiny and cool. Up top, because I mean, oh, actually the block is just going to be right here. So, you know, it, it's going to light up the top part, which is the most important part. I don't want anything uh, scary getting in here and, you know, touching my bees. Luckily, after harvesting so many of these, these trees i can go around and add in all of this and perfect next because i've been using so much diorite let's use some of the dacite and from this now i don't want it to be super duper pointy like i don't want it to like kind of look like a pyramid so on this inner layer also to uh, just prevent like seeing through too much uh, because of the leaves so we're gonna go around add in an extra layer around it just like this and beautiful this is actually exactly what i was hoping for with this kind of didn't really plan it out i'm just doing this all on the fly so once we actually get those light blocks you're not gonna be able to see through it whatsoever and i like it how we can't see through there because of those blocks next up however we need a splash of color there's a whole lot of white but we got to remember it's going to be a little bit orange right here like like an orangish yellow because of the glowstone so this next hi buddy um oh god no okay we need to get rid of all the saplings oh god if i break these trees it'll actually delete the leaves oh no the log went through it okay not a good sign uh okay First off, we need to get rid of this. Yeah, go away. Get away from my leaves. Um, okay, I think we're good now. Yeah, I need to get rid of those saplings really badly. Don't break anything else. Okay, good. And you. Beautiful. Okay, I think we're safe. I think everything got rid of. I think we got rid of everything. Okay, as I was saying. Now, uh, this color is going to be for the bottom part. It's not going to be seen up top, so we don't have to worry too much. I think for this... So we're going to want to put a block. Where did I just put that block? Oh, yeah, block there. There we go. Okay. Then we're going to be putting down some logs here. And this layer, we're just going to go all the way around. I got perfect, even though it uh, doesn't look red right now. So now we just need to go around, strip the entire thing, which this is totally going to break my axe. Now, I know it's not the best coloring, but 
man i really i really wish that i could work with like red concrete I feel like that would have been way better uh you know definitely would have been my choice for this but again I, i'm trying my best with the modded blocks and i, I kind of want to do like challenges like this for the next building i think it'll be for the villagers what color combo would you like me to uh, attempt to build with you know please go easy on me but i'm kind of curious if there's like as i was saying wait what was i saying uh something about uh new color combos just go easy on me i i don't know i, I just i want to i want to keep trying out different builds in this series you know and try out different color combos and different blocks and what i like normally and comfortably always build with i don't know if you guys have like any uh any ideas of what to do i you know i'm down for the challenge i think it'd be fun also if any of you know anything about bark in this game like please tell me is it worth it to keep or should i just like get rid of all this bark like i, I really don't know kind of like really don't care to keep it as well if i'm being honest however okay if we're gonna continue with red i oh don't want to fall down that um i do need to go around and collect more of it which i think it was you right okay beautiful yes yeah. sadly the one tree that i'm uh working with and it doesn't really drop that much wood per tree how are you out here and not on fire at first like you, you just had to get that shot off oh dear god there's another one please please no. okay so it's gonna be a very slight pattern change now but we need to start closing this off i don't really think that i need to go any deeper i mean we could probably go one deeper just in case if i ever do need to build anything yeah because this is gonna be the top layer so right now that would only be like a one block building space room in here so yeah actually here we're going to go one down one over and then we're gonna fill in this entire layer beautiful then the next layer actually no no okay we're gonna go two in and then i think after two we go three of these and then like one of that yeah Wait, 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 no, 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 scratch that. Now we're, uh, we're kind of building it. Why are you there? Oh, no, go away. No, why are you there? Okay, as I'm trying to say, we're starting to actually build a, uh, a mob spawner in here, and I uh, would really rather not have that. So, a fun way around that, and also just so we could light up the uh, the bottom of this even more. We're actually going to go around with some leaves, and then everywhere that the leaves are being put, that's where uh, we're going to be putting glowstone on top of as well. God, I really wish that I could use sea lanterns. Oh, you have no idea how badly I love sea lanterns. Absolutely the best light source block out there. Okay, now we can go around and add in two of these. There's no way. There is no way I've used up all the the diorite that I collected. There's no way, right? Um, okay, that makes things a little bit more interesting. Okay, we might have to do a little change of plans. So let's see. So we've been using a whole lot of white on the bottom, which is cool. Nothing against that. I kind of want to bring back those uh legs that I used back uh, with my uh, autoinator. And I think there's enough room to put down two of them. And also, uh, I'm just really trying to use a whole lot of less of these blocks that I have to go out and farm because I, uh, God, that, that scares me. Okay, so first off, we're going to be using planks. It's just a way easier, cheap block. Boom. Can't really tell the difference between this and the log anyways. Okay, so with this, we're going to go down just this one block, not like that. And from here and then we go in and then we go one two three four and then we go in this direction and boom so that's the size of one leg oh this is perfect yes no not not like that that's not perfect oh wait that's actually a little bit more perfect okay and perfect so yes we can actually have the two legs right there i guess in the center where this eye is honestly let's just you know slap in these blocks right here fill this all in and i think we're pretty good with that okay this is coming along nicely i'm not you know not too worried about it now i really need to start planning out my builds better <laughs> but then that removes all of the fun okay so from here god um okay i think i have a lot of dacite so i think we can actually use a lot of dacite for building so i kind of want the rings like the red rings to actually be on the outside of the pillar so then maybe for the leg leg part of it we can go here go down so it'll just be white on the inside and then this can also go down one more block next up we have to deal with lighting and definitely for that we're gonna be slapping out the maple leaves again sure i think we can just build from the ground now because now i'm starting to want to oh god yeah i actually need to light up this entire area down here so maybe this is what we'll use the legs for maybe for the legs 
we have them come out like that for the lighting. I think this is fine. Again, all of this is gonna look so much better once I get some glowstone. And then from there, we just drop this down one. It's not the worst. Like, it's not that ugly, I think. Um, What we can do here for an extra splash of color is instead of going down two more blocks, we just go down the one. Beautiful, we keep it all nice and hollow just for a whole lot less resources. And I feel like at the bottom, okay, so now we need to start coming out, but I wanna use a different block down here. So just to change it up, we'll use actual like cherry wood and oh man, we barely had enough for that. And then obviously we're gonna go around and just strip all of these, keep it nice and red. Okay, beautiful. I think to end it all off, we can actually just use the dacite and we'll just bring it all the way down to the floor. <gasps> Wait, no. Oh, even better. So for the areas all the way down here, we'll use leaves. And then behind all of these leaves, there'll be more glowstone. And that will light up the ground down here perfectly, even though it's only going to be on one side. Ah, I didn't want to be there. Even though it'll only be one side, it'll at least bring in some lighting. And then we'll just figure it out for all the other areas. And there we go. So I mean, not too bad. If anything, I might add some slabs at the very top just to make it like kind of branch out a little bit more. But I think this is fine. I just basically now I need to copy this for this side. So uh, God, that's gonna be fun. And ta-da, my little nuclear uh, towers are uh, done. And I feel like I need to add more. <laughs> I really feel like I need to add more. So first off, just like how I said before, let's see what this looks like with uh, some slabs around it. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, definitely need to do that. So I like that, let's do it to the other side. I have to say, this is so much easier like building it like this when it's not like 60 blocks off the ground. Like, wow, this takes so much less like scaffolding, even though I'm not using any. It's so much faster to build this, like, wow insane and beautiful next i feel like i want to add in even one more block right there just to make it like like an even wider expansion and i also kind of want to add something right there i i don't like how empty that feels but i don't know if oh god do i want to add in cherry trap doors around this or do i want to use maple logs which will be like a lighter block i think i i think i do want to do that because i don't want to overpower this too much with the red because the red really draws your attention like you don't really notice any of the white blocks but you sure notice that so here let's see uh hopefully this looks cool okay so oh wait and this one even has like glass on it okay well, let's see okay luckily there's no design on it that i have to worry about like it's just universal any direction that that you use it so i love that and i actually really like that and i like how it goes all the way to the leaves i love that yeah yeah because it's like a really nice border adds in some more design so that at least kind of draws your attention so everything kind of just like smoothly goes so definitely gonna be making a whole lot of those oh plus i like how like right here it kind of just brings them together and oh god it's a wiener yeah yeah, ooh, I like that a lot more than the left side. Okay, beautiful. Now I just need to do the same thing to the other side. Beautiful. Okay, I think that's everything that I need there. I'm almost tempted to add these trap doors right there and then like push them down so they're onto the dash site. But, hmm. Oh, wait, I could do railings. No, but the railings wouldn't be up there. They'd be down there. I could add fences. I think fences could look nice. Some like maple fences for it. Here, uh, I need to clean up my inventory. I keep forgetting I have a backpack and I can just do this okay wait, maybe not fences what are you hold up this might be a fun block it's a modded block too i think i like that so it's still like fences gives us the same thing it's just it takes up more space compared to a fence and i think i actually really like that i like that a lot more than fences okay it's also not like that expensive I and mean, it's kind of expensive but not like too expensive okay beautiful and i think I think with that, I think we're done with the legs. Uh, the biggest part is just waiting for the lighting, which, oh God, I uh, I know I should. It's just, I really don't want to go into the nether. I kind of feel like I should add something here. Oh, actually, before we go up top and we start doing some uh, building up there, finally, I think if I just add some railings for all of these red uh, 
log parts. I think that's actually a whole lot better. I, I just like how it just kind of slopes it a little bit, you know? It just makes everything look nice and flat, even though it's super duper unbelievably busy. Like, it's a super busy design, but I, I think it works, honestly. Like, I don't think it's that bad, so I'm excited to see what uh, all of you have to say about it, but I, and I, I think I'm doing a good job. And there we go. Okay. I'm gonna force myself to step away from this. I think we're good. Like, the only thing I would do is, like, maybe something here. Like, I would maybe put some fences right there. But I, we, we have other stuff to do. You know, I, I can't worry too much about the legs. The the one spot that we're never really going to be looking at. Uh, I just realized how dark it is down there. That is a complete spawning area uh yeah instead of lanterns just because it's not gonna be permanent yeah let's just go around with some torches you know let's do a little bit of lighting up oh my god hi don't hit me ow stop it. okay maybe that's a sign that we need to light up in here okay i feel way more comfortable after putting down 62 torches now comes this part which i was honestly kind of dreading a little bit um well given how i still have white sand and i've never used this yet uh maybe at least for the border right here so this part you know we're still not going to add anything to this this is all glowstone so i think we just go around with the sand right here okay and i kind of like that i'm god okay no I i've been putting this off for so long i think we have to go into the nether now i really can't fill up this entire floor or else this will be spawning in mobs in here and i really don't want that so oh boy this is gonna be a little rough uh we're gonna make it as fast as possible in there i do not want to stay in the nether whatsoever okay, so given how i do have a diamond pick i don't actually need to care too much about where i place it and all of my bees are gone did they despawn or something did they despawn or die because i don't see them on a mini map at all whatever so i guess that was a waste going and getting those bees so that's my bad but i do have five obsidians we can at least start something um we'll build it somewhat like i don't know like over here this luckily does not matter oh that looks really trippy okay. and well i need to go get five more so uh there might be a cave this direction if i remember correctly i think there's a like an underwater cave this direction and we might be able to find some obsidian down here hi bud you a uh, little stuck down there almost like you should stay over here in the village huh why do i feel like every single villager has left the village like look you you don't like the village for whatever reason yeah maybe i do need to trap every single villager like i just need to like move them out of the village and into like my own building they might hate it at first but hey you know i am actually saving them from themselves like dude just just go back home what are you doing out here you silly willy there you go. wait there's lava right here uh oh exposed iron bars whoa that's sick i'm not gonna lie uh i, I'm, I am gonna be taking this uh, i just I, I can't lie this will at least save me two so i just need three more right, maybe in the future i'll you know replace those uh probably not don't believe there is any other spots with lava and it is starting to get nighttime do you have a bed here let's see are you a deep cave oh okay wait wait i think i found it i think this is the deep cave there's allegedly lava right here oh god there's also no oxygen down here no 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 Ow! there we go not even close wasn't even worried let's see allegedly here no 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 Oh my god, ugh! Why is the water bucket strat not working? Okay, that was that was really dumb. No, that, that was really dumb. Oh, I am guessing winter is coming as uh, ice is starting to form. Yeah, that might make things a little interesting. Okay. Uh, I don't know how to prepare for winter. Like, I don't know if anything bad is about to happen in here. Please get down the hole. Very quickly, boom, that. Why is the water not going away? There we go. Jeez. I cannot see whatsoever. So, uh, hopefully the editor can, uh, brighten up the footage so we can actually see in here. Ah, so much nicer. Thank you. That's the horror down there. Yep. Horror monsters. Yep. Very scary. <gasps> oh, wait, you're in another white block. What are you? Diorite. Oh, wait, that's diorite. Hello. Never once in my life did I think that I would be excited to be collecting this stuff, but let me just get a little bit of you. Okay, like a stack and a half should be good enough. Don't need to go too crazy with it. And I could have sworn there was lava near where I was, you know, digging down. Hi. Why am I bright? Why is... Why is everything bright? 
glowing quiver oh, okay because you were shooting me with special arrows got it all righty obsidian where are you i mean your irons i don't mind you let's see here let's just run past hello lava yep i need you to not follow me or you nope that's totally okay thank you Whew. okay we at least have lava down here but i have a yeah no that, that's a bad sign because it's only just one singular block of it <gasps> Ooh, speaking of block, even though you can't really see it at all, there is some redstone, which I feel like I should actually collect it because I might want to actually start using some kind of like redstone machines in here. I don't know if I need gold. Like I, I'm pretty sure I have a lot back in my base, but sure, I'll collect some. Is that seriously all the lava is just that one source? right there like there's no way oh dear god i wish i could see uh okay we might just want to return home and then make some torches so we can actually see down here what are you raw cryo marble shard sure i don't know what that does what it's for if it was like fully grown but sure cryo light so it's like a brown looking block okay i mean i guess we might be another like substitute for wood my only assumption sure i'll, I'll collect like a little bit of you why not okay well i don't I think we want to be traveling that direction, so we definitely want to go back. Actually, yeah, here, let, let's just return back home. Oh, yeah, no, it's definitely becoming winter. Uh, well, I'm hoping that doesn't affect anything. Hi! That's really not good. Uh, is there a cow here? Oh, God. Achoo! Oh, they didn't like that. Did not like it. Did not, did not, and did not like that. Uh, wait, wait, wait. No, no, I know how to do this. Okay, I need all of you yes 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 the guy with the flag if you guys can start shooting him no no the guy with the flag yes 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 a little bit more why are my hearts freezing why am i freezing what are you guys shooting me with oh my god wait 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 wait! i didn't realize that you guys were this deadly uh okay well, i'm gonna say bye to you at least you guys are all killing the wrong one please the one with the flag there we go there we go come on come on come on come on oh my god get, get into the house get in the house get in the house get in the house get in the house 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 let's go let's go let's go oh my gosh wow these so my leaves are now black instead of brown they're not gonna decay right oh my god okay just 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 Stay in here. Should be, you know, fine and safe in here. Uh, let's see. Yeah, am I in trouble with all those leaves? Okay, we can at least go back out here. Where did you guys go? Get over here. Stop exploring my house. Where's the one with the flag? Hi, you. Yeah, where's your buddy? I know you're not the last one. There's no way the other one died. There he is. Okay, well, he's down there. I don't feel like making you walk all the way down there, so goodbye to you. <sighs> Actually, here, let me go to sleep. We need to go find a cow. All right, a failure, let's do this. Okay, I need you to not shoot me. At, okay, I didn't even turn the corner. Ah, stop. So lucky I can't hit you yet. Where's a cow? Cow. Okay, well, I mean, there's a horse, but I think they'll give me a different type of liquid. Oh, hey, there you are. Okay, beautiful. Now that I have you, I can go over to this. Well, boop, get rid of you quickly. Drink, 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 drink. Okay, beautiful. Woo! I mean, you know, I would have survived the raid, you know, would have done really well. Kind of don't want to lose my entire village, though, so. Oh my god! Oh my Jesus! Where did you come from? You didn't even make any noise! Jesus! I I'm not going insane, right? That thing actually did not make any noise. Jesus. And then we just cover this up like nothing ever happened. Before we go back out, might as well just go put everything away. Fully situated. I actually have lighting. And that means that I'm ready to go. Wow, that's so weird to see black leaves on an oak tree. But, uh, okay, if I can get back down there. This isn't gonna freeze while I'm down here right that might actually kill me and eh, probably not i'm way too goaded to die where did i put that hole oh, there you are oh there we go oh so much nicer i can actually see what's around here and uh what wants to kill me hey. oh you little you know no 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 come up here i didn't think this through you can still see my feet uh that means I can still shoot you. Now, I'm not going to try and spawn proof the entire place, but I would like to make it to where things won't really spawn near me as I'm going down the waterfall because I kind of would rather not get shot at just like this little lovely little muffin right here. There we go. Nice and easy. Oh, hello, glow ink sacks. Thing. Glow squid. Okay. Thank you. Uh, okay. Well, we might as well. I mean, seeing how rare lava is for some reason we might as well go to the source block of this lava and yeah, don't light me on fire 
please. Thank you. Okay, let's just put you down. Next. Okay, we'll make this little spot right there. So boom, now when lava falls down, it's not gonna come towards me. All right, it won't really like come out here. Let's go ahead, start chipping away at the blocks right here. And I have a really bad feeling about this. Um, Here, let's go up to here. Here, perfect. And boom, now, okay, we got one thing of obsidian. There we go, just give me seven minutes. Perfect, okay, I think that'd be the three. I think we need two more. Okay, uh, let's see, left or right? I have a feeling I wanna go right. So, jump down here, go, 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 don't be slow. Yep, that's good, skeleton shot a zombie. Zombie miner, huh? That can be a lot of jokes with that. Okay, beautiful, dear God, there's so much fighting going on. I kinda wanna kill the miner, not that kind of miner. Okay, wait a second, wait a second, wait a second. Okay, wait, wait, pause, pause, pause. You know what, I got a lot of arrows, a lot of arrows. Yep, yep, uh-huh. Yeah, yep. Mm -hmm. Yep, precisely. Yep, calculated. Yep, good. Okay, yep, don't you dare touch me with that enchanted sword. Yep, there you go. When in doubt, bow it out. Okay, so I just got a soul star? Where does it lead bosses of mass destruction? Oh, okay, that sounds pretty good to me. Very clearly, we don't want to go this direction. We don't want to go up. Here, let's just start lighting you up. So, I love to be able to see. Don't hit me. Ooh, more quivers. Are quivers just not rare whatsoever? Because I believe that's my fourth pair that I've just gotten. They really don't seem that rare. Okay, uh, next up looking at the mini map we're gonna do a little bit of cheating let's make a staircase going down we need to get deeper i mean we're at negative 43 right now so i mean we should be at the optimal lava levels so hopefully i can find two more okay then we're gonna make a sharp turn this direction and then we're just gonna mine in a straight line just so i can get to that lava <laughs> i am i'm going to take the easy way out and just head this direction hopefully this won't take long i'm really hoping i don't have to use that much of my diamond pick okay this should be relatively actually no, no no okay we need to go down a little bit more we're almost to the perfect spot for lava and from here wow okay hello more than one more than two yes yes i'm i'm a little speechless okay oh nice okay we got nine diamonds out of that uh i'm honestly a little speechless uh -huh. Wasn't expecting that at all. Sick, I'll take some diamonds, why not? Okay, now, even though this pick is just about to break, that sucks. But it shouldn't matter, because as soon as this gets close to breaking, I'm just not gonna use it anymore. But hey, at least now I can actually mine faster. What is that symbol on the minimap right next to the lava? Like, to the left of the lava stream that I'm going toward? What is that? There's no way that's a structure, right? That has to be a mob. And it's gone. Uh, that makes me nervous. What was that? Okay, come on out, lava. Come out, come out wherever you are. Okay, well, that's an issue that I don't hear it. So, let's see. Are you below me? Are you above me? Dog, where oh, hey, there you are, man. You sly dog, you. And you were trying to stay hidden from me, man. I thought we were friends. Okay, so, very luckily, we're just gonna... I'll try and leave, like, some of the lava here. Like, I don't want to get rid of all of it, you know? Um, I don't think there's any diamonds here. Yeah, nah, it doesn't look like there's anything of value here. Okay, so... Okay, let's see. If I go back here, get rid of this, I can then put down the water bucket right there and then once i break this and there's most definitely lava right below it or not okay never mind i was expecting oh don't tell me this is only a one block tall lava lake i'll collect a little bit more obsidian than what we need for the portal just in case if there's some recipe for something really good that i want but i have to have obsidian for it so just thinking about the future here really don't want to have to come back down in here and uh get more so we'll just we'll just spend some lovely quality time in here collecting obsidian okay well i got 12 so i can even make another portal if i really wanted to uh anyways i am totally done with mining all of that that is like so unbearably slow La -da -dee. don't let there be anything out here for me please no creeper to give me a jump scare scare nothing shoot me just everything just stay away just let me escape these what nope 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 i am okay i do not like that laughter that laughter with that kind of echo i'm okay i'm okay oh my gosh she's right there no 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 don't throw thank you i don't want your baba there you go please be 
daylight outside. Yeah, actually, no, it might be nighttime. Why is there a block there? I Wait, what hole did I go down? That? I never remember putting one back up. And it, whoa, that looks so cool. Oh my God, that lake froze so fast. Dog, I was down there for like, what, 15, 20 minutes? Wow. Oh, that looks so cool. Uh, I'm okay with not going back to my house. And nice, you guys have three iron golems right here. Uh, do you have a bed right here? No, but you have some loot in there. Uh, where's a bed? I, I really don't feel like running back to my house and having a creeper blow up my entrance. Oh, the door's gone. Interesting. Alrighty, my eyes are uh, peeled. Yeah, no, just get rid of you. Ooh, you dropped some stuff for me. Oh my God, you spoil me so much. Okay, where's the creeper? I know there's a creeper. There, there's always a creeper. Damn, beautiful portal is created. Just need to go make that flint and steel. Also get organized. <gasps> oh, also. So I know I can upgrade this backpack as well, but honestly, I'd rather just upgrade the backpack that's on me. So I think it was like, what, you do this with like... Boom, boom, bop, bing? Of course not. Okay, to make you, uh, of course it's four, not two. Oh, that sucks. Um, Yeah, I'm definitely not upgrading my other backpack then at that point. Okay, so that just leaves us with seven, but uh, we're just gonna hope that this upgrade is worth it. Oh, God, it's just gonna give me one more line, isn't it? Did I just put them all in the wrong spot? So, okay, so we've got five compared to three. Oh, okay. Wait, you're almost like twice as good. Never Never mind. Maybe you're not that much. Oh my God. Imagine the next ones, especially if I get to endless backpack. Oh, you have to be able to scroll up and down. Oh, that's going to be so much fun. Okay, so time is running out. I won't lie, but at the very least, I really want to finish this flooring and just by eyeballing it. Oh God. So just by eyeballing it, I think we need around four stacks of glowstone. Uh, that's just taking a complete guess. Like, I, I'd rather be safe and get a little bit more than what I need. So I think four, or at least three and a half. Oh, wait, I need to make the flints too. Do I really not have any flint? This entire time? Wow, okay. I made it that far without making any not making but gathering any flint. Okay. That's Definitely in winter times. That's gonna be rough. Please, please, please. Oh. Please, please. I just want one flint, man. Please. <gasps> Finally, thank you. Okay, I see why I, I haven't gotten any flint this entire time. Come on, just one more. Yes, thank you. Okay, I'll take it. That's three. Beautiful. You even got some cobblestone out of that. Okay. And please, for the love of God, don't be that difficult inside of there. Please. Oh, I really don't want to die. Okay, we'll bring the flint and steel just to be safe. I'm going to leave my bucket empty because I really want to get a lava bucket in there in case anything tries to chase me. We can light it on fire. Oh, also, wait, before we go, let's make an iron pick. Really don't want to use this diamond. Okay, now we're ready to go. Oh my God, I'm so scared to go in here. <laughs> Oh, I don't want to do this. I don't want to do this. Oh, I really do not want to do this. Oh, let's do it. Hello? Okay. Oh my God, where am I? Uh, okay, lava, boom, immediately gone. What is this? Am I in honey? Oh my God, I don't want to go anywhere. Where am I? What is ember gel block? I actually kind of want you. Wait, wait, wait. What if I break you? Ah, oh, it doesn't count. Okay, let's see. Do I care enough for you? No, you're just like regular brown wood. Uh, here you go. Okay, next question. How? Oh, you break instantly. Okay, that makes you a little bit more fun to get. So I'm going to assume with these I've... what was that dog I, I i just want to collect a tree right now and then there's an explosion going off what are those i'm 100 going to die in here uh, i i 100 yeah, leave it in the comments down below right now do you think i'm going to die in the nether or do you think i'm going to make it out alive i'm very strongly believing that i'm going to die in here oh my god dude don't uh, okay, well, we got 22 of those. Maybe I can use it for some kind of building. Really don't care to uh, stay here to figure it out. I'm not going to hit you, actually. Well, let's just shoot you. Glowstone dust. Okay, I now have an incentive to kill you all. Because speaking of glowstone, where do I go for some? Let's see. Ember Nihilium. Are you going to burn me? No. Okay. Yeah? Yeah, you want to jump at me again, buddy? Huh? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Look, look what happens to you. Mm-hmm. There you go. Yep. There you go. Yep. Break you. Nope. Nope. Break you. There you go. Please break. There we go. I'm just going to take it that everything in here wants to kill me. So, hey, yeah, if 
any of you know anything about these mobs in here and you know if they're friendly or not, I, I don't really believe you guys, actually. I have a strong feeling that you guys are just gonna lie to me and then I'm gonna go hug something that explodes. Okay, speaking of exploding, let me collect all of these. Pollen block. Did I go to the nether or am I in a giant beehive? Because none of this is really sounding like the nether. Ember gel block. Okay. Never mind. I don't know why I was surprised by that. Oh, pollen dust. Okay. I don't know what the pollen dust does. Can I do it like that? Okay. So I can't even make it into a block. Uh, well, at least I can always find my portal. So in my... Hi. Hello. Never mind. I'm in heaven. Hello. Hello. Oh, my lag. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Why are you mad? Are you are you mad at me? Jesus. Why did you do that? Yeah, let's just break that. I'm not, not going to deal with that. Are you guys okay? Are, are you okay? Are you good? Stop. Icebreaker 5 increases the damage from attacking enemies frozen in ice. What? <gasps> Protection three. Ooh, you might, you might actually be better than my iron boots. Uh, I'll wear you. Why not? Take all of the, why is there tomato seeds in here? And we'll take the nether ward. Why not? Uh, don't care for those. Don't care for that. I am so uneasy in here. Couldn't care less for any of the, uh, the discs. So yeah, I'm just going to be leaving those. And wow, would you look at that backpack? Oh boy. I can sure put a whole lot of stuff in here. Can I, oh man, you can't even put another backpack in a backpack i really wish you could makes sense though well that was a really dope find so i gotta keep an eye out for any uh kind of treasure rooms in here wasn't expecting to actually find loot uh so speaking of loot where where's glowstone nether bricks okay that makes me nervous well i didn't get the achievement so i'm going to assume that there's no fortress down there dear god i had to spawn in the worst biome uh, surely glowstone up here right well at least it's decently friendly right now em ember lily huh i can actually walk across this i can actually walk across that okay that actually surprised me oh <gasps> wait 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 new biome new biome oh my god wait there's less lava over there okay i like that more i'm coming beautiful okay so that hurts uh actually i'll collect a few if you want to i know that why did you just light on fire which is what is lighting that on fire Oh my god. Hello? Dude, there's nothing. Oh, there you are. I was like, there's nothing over here lighting anything on fire. How is it combusting? Okay, well, while it stays over there, whatever, we're just gonna keep on collecting, keep an eye on him. Um, okay, if I take you and I do this. Okay, so rock quartz block and you don't do anything. So I don't care for you. Unless I should care for it, and then I'll just wait for all of the comments to tell me that I should care for it. But I don't think I need to care for it. Anyways, in case I ever need to make observers then i at least have the quartz for it and very luckily it seems like they're super duper easy to get so this biome's actually nice ow okay please hit it okay how about this one hit it Okay, can I hit it with this one? Oh, you're behind a block. Okay, whatever, cheater. My god. Maybe in the future we want to build a witch farm because, uh, wow, is there no... That's kind of cool. There's no glowstone, like, anywhere. Like, I'm not even being picky. I just straight up haven't seen it. Nope. Okay, wait, no, it can't be that one. So who's shooting at me? I, I don't see your projectiles at all. Oh my god, wait, wow, there actually is another fortress right there. Uh that's why they're spawning in okay well let's just get out of this biome then because the only useful thing that i've gotten out of it is just those quartz so, okay oh sweet just random glowstone on the ground sure i don't mind you hi can you not touch me quartz sand block Wait, wait, wait. I just remember. I don't know why I forgot about it. Maybe I should collect these for building purposes. Because it's another white block. It's another white block that I can use for uh, designs. Some, like, you know, nice decorations, maybe. And they don't take too long to collect. So here, we'll, we'll collect a little bit. Maybe I can use it. It could be a nice transition block since it is a little bit darker than white. Dear God, what are you? Hello? Hello, chill. 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 I can trade with you. Okay, just chill. Chill. Dear God. Uh, oh, wait, can I buy glowstone? Oh my God. Wait, if I get four ancient debris to give me five netherite scrap, that's actually really nice. Netherite ingots, and I get a totem of undying. Our protection, five. Okay, six. So things go higher than four. You can even go to six. Okay, very nice. I mean, God, ugh, I really wish that you were selling it, buddy. Ooh, you'd make a nice profit from me. But, um, okay. So luckily, you don't want to kill me. I actually thought that's what you wanted to do. Oh my God, wait. Wait, 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 wait. Can I pick you up? 
Dang it. Oh. And I was gonna say, what if I pick him up, I bring him back to the overworld and then I name tag. Cause then if I name tag him, I'm going to assume that he won't despawn. And then if he's not gonna despawn, boom, I just, you know, make him like a little pit or something, you know? So then, uh, like if he's in that pit, boom. And then I go for uh, ancient debris, I go back to him, boom. I have even more than uh, what I mine. But nope, of course the game had to, you know, see through that. What was that? Uh, what what was what was that noise? I really don't want to meet them. Hi, buds. Yeah, oh, yep. Say goodbye to you guys. Bloodstone. You're kind of cool. I'm safe, right? Okay. Yeah, you're kind of cool. And you're actually craftable. Okay. Well, here, uh, if you guys ever want me to build something with like black bricks, this would be a really good transition block. And luckily, since it is really close to my portal, I don't need to collect too much of it. I'm just gonna collect. Okay enough of it to where if i do want to use it then i you know i can at least try out this block and then you know if i need more boom i just come back here uh anyways uh we need to be very careful with what we mine now if i use you on that do i get more than one let's see 21 can you do something for me hi buddy okay well that one gave me two that one gave me one it also gave me one that gave me one surely there has to be some glowstone somewhere come on or there has to be an entire mob of skeletons hello i just realized oh my god oh my god oh my god they deal so much damage oh my god Oh my god. Oh my god. One of their arrows did half of my health. Okay. Oh my god. I, I, wow. Okay. I genuinely thought I was dead. I, I wasn't even talking. I was completely focused on trying to get out of there. I was just trying to predict all their shots. Wow. We. Okay. Um, dude, I can't even use shroom lights. I can't even find those. Uh, the other thing, if I somehow get frogs, if I get frogs and I feed them magma cubes, I could get frog lights, but that takes so much effort i think i can jump this actually i'm not even gonna test that I, I i trust myself but i really don't want to do something stupid and be like wow i would have been alive if i just walked to the left oh okay wait so you're not bouncy oh whoa whoa you move like sonic speed on here whoa okay that's sick okay it seems like you take less fall damage at least yeah i definitely think you take less just need to make it back to the portal that's all we need to do nothing come out please you know everything in the another let's just be friends we're all in here suffering together we don't need to make it harder on ourselves why did that sound so echoey and ominous let's go around and yeah we're definitely going to be plugging up some of these holes here let, let's go click like a little bit more yeah we kind of need to go through and just baby proof our nether just a little bit you know yeah just you know want to cover up all of these yeah very beautiful boom okay uh man this really ain't looking good uh, I guess I'll collect you right now. Here, we'll, we'll take a nice little peaceful break. Uh, just wind down just a little bit, you know, collect us some slime balls. Oh my god, hi. Yep, I figured. I figured, yep, that, that's why I'm hitting everything. I figured that was gonna blow up on me. Okay, so I'm actually happy that I've been collecting a whole lot of these because, I mean, it looks, like, it looks like honey. So you, you just know that it's going to be amazing to build like a beehive structure out of it. Stop shooting. Just die. Thank you. Uh, let's see. Did you drop any blaze rods? Did you just drop ash pile? Oh God. Don't tell me they don't drop any blaze rods. Oh no. Maybe we should click some wood. Cause I just might be able to burn up. I mean, I mean, if it's wood in the nether, I'm going to assume that it can't burn. So at least with this, we'll have some kind of building material to get through here. Yes, yes, more slime balls. Yes, yes, give me. Yes, yes, I need my slime. Alrighty, all organized. And okay, let's just start scouting. Maybe if we go this direction, maybe, maybe this is where all of it is hidden, huh? There's just nothing. There's no glowstone anywhere. Oh God, but if I want to make a witch farm, oh dude, I am not going to be doing a 100 by 100 hole. There is no way I could put myself to do that. Uh, I would ideally would love to come back in here with an elytra, but I don't see myself going to the end any time soon because that does not look easy like at all okay still no glowstone the boomy boom boom yep that's right whoa you look sick okay uh yeah let's be honest you're probably deadly oh there we go yep 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 that is the sign of something that is unbelievably deadly so yeah we never want to get close to them even though they look really really cool love their design uh yeah just don't mind me just gonna come on through wow that thing did so much damage and there's another one 
I mean, it's definitely fun shooting them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get, get close to the plant really quick. Oh, okay. You're going to go the other direction. Whatever. Still no glowstone anywhere. Okay, so it's going to continue this route. Don't, don't, no, 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 dog. No, no, no. You, you don't need to play creepy environmental sounds. It's totally fine. Oh, uh, that did not sound good. I think I'm safe. I just really need to get out from right here. Do, do, do. I hate being in the nether an unbelievable amount. Oh my God, I'm on it. Like edge in here. Uh, please, just some glowstone. Like, I was talking like, oh yeah, I'm just gonna go in here and get four stacks of it. I'm lucky to make it out of here with two. So far, I have one. And I got that from stupid mobs. Dude, I've only been 300 blocks? Really? Wow, it feels like I've already traveled like a thousand at least. Oh, I don't like that sound. I don't like that sight. Don't mind me, don't mind me just running across. Is this a geode? Oh, actual blazer. Oh, I don't, oh my god, hi. Yep, you definitely go sonic speed across these. So, uh, okay, there we go now i got it um where's the gas uh, oh, oh my god wait it's a different biome oh it's a different biome okay it's a gravel ow it's a gravel biome okay i i think i actually kind of like oh my god oh no way it does exist it's real the one piece the one piece is real oh my gosh there's so much right there too oh this is this is amazing ow okay so everything in here does damage and everything wants to kill you can, can you mind I, i'm trying to commentate here thank you so everything in here wants to kill me i don't really have that many building blocks uh okay let's go back and let's collect some wood i'm going to be needing a lot because i'm going to be making a whole lot of platforms i'm collecting every single ounce of glowstone over there okay almost two seconds of wood now we can come back over here hopefully dodge every single thing that wants to hurt me just like all of those plants right there oh my god what is why is there so many like environmental noises around here this place is okay so we definitely want to build some form of platform around here so nothing can fall below or else i will cry on camera yes 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 Ooh, beautiful yes Ooh, so nice i really wish that if i used my fortune pick that it would actually give me more glowstone dust. Like, I'll try it out with this one, but I'm very positive it won't. Yeah, like, that only gave me three. That one gave me four. And that one gave me four. So, eh. Don't think it does. And I'd rather not waste it at all. I might actually go down there for that. I'm not gonna lie. I, I, I might. Depends on how much I end up with. Well, of course, there just couldn't be any glowstone over here. Like, not above lava. I love the echo, like, scream of them. I don't know why, but it's so funny and dumb. Goodness, can this wind calm down? You really don't need to add anything else to the nether to make it more anxiety-inducing, I, I promise you. Alrighty, well, that's all the wood I had. Let's hope that I can get every single piece. We're just going to be careful, break one at a time, and then pick it up. So I increase the chances of nothing falling into lava. So far, so good. Half of the chunk is gone. <sighs> yes. Oh, okay. Okay, we can actually go. Oh, we can get off. Okay. Yeah, whew. A little bit safer. That's a thing? Wait, that's actually kind of cool. Polished glowstone? Okay, wait. That actually really piques my interest. That is actually kind of similar to uh that's actually so similar to uh sea lanterns which i really love using um okay so yeah i don't think there's any glowstone that direction um i would leave a waypoint for here but i just don't see any other glowstone here so it might have just gotten super lucky and that might be all of it maybe i'm also curious if i leave a waste stone right here would i even be able to like teleport back to one of my overworld ones and then from the overworld can i teleport back to this one like it, it does it work with different dimensions because i would assume not since that would be really really overpowered because imagine a waystone right at an enderman xp farm like imagine how nice that would actually be please just die oh dear god okay well they're just never gonna stop here let's just very quickly try and collect wood before they come over here very nice we got 56 to work with okay ah uh, here, before I even continue on, since I can just pick up the waystone, let's let's test it out. Let's see. If I go right here, you know, we just do like a little boop. Now, do you work? Oh my god, you work. There is no way. Nether glow stove. There's no way. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. What I can actually teleport 
right back into my house from the nether. Oh, I love waste stones. Oh my, oh dude, you have no idea how much I love those. That's so broken. That's a thing. Uh, also speaking of thing, uh, yep, the lakes are now completely frozen over. I believe we're nearing like full on winter. Uh, also speaking of full on winter. Oh, okay, wait, oh no. Okay, well, there goes our sugarcane farm. So that's actually good to know though. Uh, whenever I make a sugarcane farm in the future, I have to make sure that I have it just completely covered in light in there just so that uh, ice can never form. Sucks, but at least we found that out now. Um, I can't get over that. I can't believe I can just teleport from the nether into here. That is actually so amazing to me. Well, uh, hey, since I'm here, might as well put all this new building block stuff into a chest right here. Here you go. A whole lot of stuff to build with. Very beautiful. Wow. Okay. I kind of want to go back into the nether. I won't lie. Okay. Well, I mean, <sighs> full inventory. I can actually go back in there and do it. Uh, I can't believe that I could just do this and just be right back in here. Oh my gosh. That is incredible. Uh, oh, ho, 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 ho. oh, you thought you could hide from me. Okay, but uh, definitely picking up the waste stone. This isn't like an ideal spot for it. And actually, can, do you mind? I'm trying to talk here. So actually, before we go over there, I already know I'm going to be needing a whole lot more wood. Okay, and then two, two stacks plus four. That should be enough. All righty, let's go make the super safe journey. What is that? Okay. But yeah, so far, definitely my most favorite biome in here. Like, not that much danger. No real places for enemies to hide. It actually has glowstone. Yeah, this place is goaded. Okay, well, very lucky for me. I don't think that I need to actually uh, make a platform up there. I, I think everything can actually drop down to the ground. Yes, my precious. Yes. Can't believe I'm doing all of this for bees. I, I have now spent nearly two days of my life just making a building for for bees and I didn't even finish it. I just really want to iterate. It's for bees. I hope you guys are proud of me. That looks so cool. What is that? It's like an obsidian, crying obsidian and like purple block shard. That's kind of cool. Hey, just uh, so I don't die, let's get down. Oh boy, we only got 22 from that. Oh boy. Uh, okay, not really ideal. Um, oh no, please don't tell me there's no more. There's more over there. Oh dear God, there is so much screaming you'd think that Justin Bieber is in here. Dear God. Oh, hey, glowstone. Oh, well, not bad. Now I got 23. Uh, Jesus Christ, God, are you okay? What's your issue? Yeah, mm. Okay, this is starting to become barren again. Why is glowstone so rare? Unless it ain't over here. Hello, beautifuls. Oh my gosh. Well, I found all the glowstone. Okay. Well, let's test out. Is this wood actually fireproof? So far, it seems like the answer is yes. Okay, next up, we're gonna go through, break all of these plants because I do believe that they actually will like delete any block that lands on them. Okay, that should be good enough. Oh, wow, that looks painful. Don't sit on that. Okay, then we're gonna travel up here. Don't need to make a platform again. I love it when I don't need to do that. Alrighty, beautiful. Fingers crossed this gives me a lot. I need to be really stingy with what I use glowstone on. I, I think I need to be like a bit stingy. Since I am collecting all of this, I will go all out. Oh, you do burn. Okay, wait, but does it get deleted? That's the more important question. Oh, <gasps> it doesn't. Okay, good, good. Okay, yep. Yeah, so this wood is fireproof. So my uh, my theory was correct. It's like any wood that you get from the nether, it's just all fireproof, which, you know, makes sense. All of you, 34 more. Okay, it's something, it's something. So, you know, we're at 57, not too shabby. Let's see, are you gonna be a kind one as well? Okay, wait, wait. Oh, yep, yep, you're a kind one. Okay, good. So we're gonna go around here, break all of this. Interesting. Huh. I mean, it would have been nice to, you know, get some uh, quartz, but uh, oh well, or not uh, amethyst, but oh well. Oh, uh, I'm gonna guess you're about 30 blocks up, so please nothing spawn in and shoot me off. Okay, and from that... Okay, that got us another stack. We might, and I, I, I say might really lightly, but we might be able to get away with... I think I have like a stack and a half back at home. I honestly forgot about it. 
but I think with like two and a half, three-ish stacks, we might be able to get away just that amount. But very luckily, okay, this biome, since, you know, it is fairly vanilla in here. Yeah, like there, there's actual glowstone here. So we'll leave a waystone in here. This is a good area to, you know, come back to whenever I run out of it. But, oh God, I might do a witch farm. I just need to find a witch hut again. Uh, oh my goodness. Oh, oh God, don't, don't look at him. Don't look at him. Okay. Nope, 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 nope. I'm okay. Nope, I know that I know that mob. I am totally okay. Not a good mob. Okay, so we're a waystone here. We're gonna do a little bit of building here. So we're gonna go around, put wood all along this. We're gonna go alongside it just like this. Which will come out to be looking like this. Very pretty and beautiful, I know. And just for a little bit more safety, we're gonna go around with another layer on top. Okay, so we can, you know, get out of here nice and easy, break up all of this, make it nice and clean. I also want to put a roof on top of this bad boy. Just want to make sure that our waystone is nice and safe, because I have a strong feeling that we're going to be coming back here a ton. Okay, just like that, we should be nice and safe in here. Can you stop growing? But you already know, we need to put down some torches in here, make it nice and brighter. And here we go with you, bop. There we go, nether glowstone, beautiful, safe, boom. Okay, we can always come back here if I weirdly want to, but. Oh, and there's a bastion. Uh, I'm not going into that right now. Nope, I uh, <laughs> I need a kind of way better armor. Yeah, new, 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 new. Definitely, uh, I'll definitely go check it out in the future. But yeah, that's when I'll have like maxed out diamond armor. And then we can go and have super duper fun uh, trying to get netherite in there. Ooh, nice. And one more, beautiful. Oh, all right, cute. It's actually going to turn everything into snow as well. Kind of an, you know, adorable mod. Oh, but this entire lake hasn't frozen over yet. Nice. I can still get some water. Yeah, I like the seasons mod. It's really cute. See, let's see. And here, boom. Oh boy. Okay, two and a half glowstone. Oh boy. Let's go see the damage that we can do. Uh, the most important part is, yeah, we're definitely going to be starting up here and then we'll go with the glowstone, like, like we'll just work down i need to be unbelievably careful with how i place this i do not want to mess it up what oh no oh my god i'm so stupid oh no i wanted to turn it into polish dog i'm not removing this um no <laughs> i i can't remove this i'm so unbelievably stupid oh my God. Ah. Oh, uh, that's gonna be staying until I have uh, some something with silk touch. Don't I have a silk touch book? Like, am I am I going a little cray cray? Silk touch and sharpness too. One, two, three. And I have collection. Let's do collection, and I'll take the silk touch with the sharpness too. So here, okay, that's six. That's one. That's what we like to see. Then we're gonna be dumb, okay? We're gonna use some of our diamonds. This is very important for me. Okay, we're gonna make a diamond axe, and then from this. Oh boy. Okay. Well, that costs eleven. Cost eleven. I think it's worth it. We're, we're gonna chance it. If anything, like I'm gonna be making villagers that will give me diamond tools and armor, so I'll at least have that in the future, so I can just make an all like new diamond axe. So. Oh wow. I, I'm I'm just trying to like make myself feel better. Why am I not getting these back at all? Like I'm not even getting dust. <sighs> Are you trying to tell me that you can't get glowstone back with silk touch? Just for, oh, well, I, I'm, I'm over it now, whatever. I'm over it. Uh, I think we'll make a witch farm. 100%, there has to be some way to easily get glowstone there. Oh my god. Uh, I can't believe that I forgot to do this. Uh, uh. Ooh, but it looks really nice. I actually really love that. Oh my god, I can't believe I messed it up. What if I do this again? Okay, so there's nothing else at least. I'm not gonna break this at all, but like anyone in the comments section, if I break polished glowstone, does it come back as the full block or is it still just gonna break into dust or just altogether disappear? I can't believe I did all of that for that diamond ax and then it didn't even work. Ugh. Oh, Skies, are you in a good mood? Yeah, I love this mod pack. Ooh, I'm having so much fun. You guys having fun watching me go insane? Ooh. Well, 
I would have had enough. I actually would have uh, completed this row right there if I didn't place down that glowstone in the beginning. I'm just going to assume that it's because it was with an axe instead of a pickaxe, even though it literally does not matter. Uh, you, you can actually use an axe with silk on it, you know, and get back glass and any other breakable block. But no, not in this one. Okay, whatever. Okay, I just need to stop complaining about it. Okay, okay. I, I, I've collected myself. You know, I, I took a nice little break, had some hot pot. Whoa. Oh, that's cool. Whoa, that's so cool. Wait, winter's actually kind of awesome. I, I actually kind of like that. Too bad it's not going to stay. Like, that would actually be really sick if it would. Um, but yeah, no, darn it. So I, I got I, I took a break. You know, I'm good to go again. And um, yeah, let's actually just go back into the nether. Actually, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I spit on you. Okay, no, no, no. What we need to do is come back up to here to this lovely. And then we go right back into the nether. Just like that. That is so cool. Oh, that's such a cool animation. Okay, so let's... Oh, wow. Well, oh, I didn't bring any blocks. Oh, actually, wait, I can collect that. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. So I can actually collect it just like that. Uh, thinking about it, I think it would actually be really smart for me to use shroom lights as well in the build. God, is someone shooting? Oh my God, is someone shooting at me? Hello? I'm looking at the mini map, and I think those are Endermen over there. What was, who has the Glock? Stop. Okay, turn off your wall hack, okay? I mean, this isn't fair right now. I'm not enjoying this. Am I blind? I feel like I'm blind. A am I blind? Do I need to go get some glasses? What, what is going on here? Okay, well, what I was going to say is uh, maybe... Ah, oh, there you are. When did you ever get here? Okay, well, uh, anyway. Is there another? There's another. Yep, there you are. Okay, wow, you guys are actually really hard to see in here. You, like, blend in with everything. So, again, what I'm trying to say is I should use shroom lights for the legs of the build. That'll actually save me just a ton. Can I break this? But it would save me a ton of time because then I won't have to come back in here, like, every half a second to try and get a glowstone. And, you know, shroom lights are, like, unbelievably easy for me to get. God, I love this uh, tree cutting mod. It's uh, such a lifesaver. Until we get to trees of this size. I also just realized how stupid I am, and I was using my diamond axe uh, to break all this stuff. So, yeah, let's not use that. There we go. Beautiful, beautiful. Come on. Be beautiful-er. Come on. Okay, what if I do that, Island? Please. Ugh. Okay, what if I do this and I do like that? Oh, okay. whatever. This game just hates me. I'm just too beautiful for it. My word. Well, uh, if I ever start... Well, not if, but whenever I start the villager trading building, uh, at least I'll have a whole lot of sticks. Do a lot of nice trading with that. How am I not... Oh, wait, no. You're not even connected to that tree right there. Why can't I break you? So it's going to be a different color, but my thought process of using shrooms on the legs instead of... Well, actually, it would just look hideous if I used it on top, since I'm already using a different block up there. But, using shroom lights down there, since we won't be able to see the glowstone from down there, we won't be able to really tell that, you know, it's different blocks being used, so. We'll be able to save ourselves there. Uh, please just give me some easy trees to break. Like that, thank you. Oh, okay. Really? Really? Is it, uh, is it because of these? Aha, uh -huh, but I know how to cheat you. Yeah, tee hee hoo hoo, I'm too smart for you. Okay, but we actually really need to be careful. So we're already down like 33% on this. So. Uh, I at least have 57 to work with. I know that's well over like more than enough. Uh, I also did not bring any uh, iron picks with me. Oh, okay. uh, we might not want to continue that direction. Okay, let's head back this direction. Okay, so I see a nice amount of glowstone right here, which I'm very interested in. Okay, well, uh, let's see. I might be able to get away without having to make a platform up there. Whoa, what is that? Oh my, okay. Well, here, let, let's just quickly collect this. I am really interested in the those blocks. Oh, that looks so cool to build with. It's like emerald and slime mixed together. Oh god. Oh, okay. Yep, right into the fire. Never mind. We are gonna build a platform. It sounds like a nightmare below me. I really don't want to meet any of those picklins. L. Okay, beautiful after Whoa. Okay, well, we got 30 now, so that's at least something. Hello, you actually look really cool whoa warp chest okay nice i wasn't aware of like all the cool blocks oh yeah i didn't get that one that was right above my uh anyways okay so i should be able to drop onto this and oh dude that is so cool i want to collect it all echinite rod ux 
Does it explode? No, okay. It's just, it said that it was a rod. And I got the entire thing. Okay, well, hey, uh, don't mind me. Just make some space. Uh, sure. Dude, I'm down. I can most definitely build something really, really cool with this. Oh, dear God, hi. Can you not do that? Uh, same exact thing. Uh, wow. Wow. Oh my gosh. Okay. Oh my God. Five dragon heads and a diamond sword and you would give me that? Oh my jeez. Please come back to my house. I would love to keep you forever. Now, I have no idea if these are craftable at all. So uh, I'm going to take my chance and I'm going to loot every single one of them here. Hopefully nothing bad comes over here wanting to fight me. I will scream like a, uh, like a girl. As in like, I'm just going to scream high pitch. I, I don't want any misunderstanding there. Curve this. Okay. Nope, didn't get that one. Yep, got that one. Dog, you really gotta give me space, huh, man? Okay, okay but I have 62 of those, so we can at least make some kind of cool windows. Uh, maybe something in the future I build is black and green, or... I don't know. I'll, I'll let you guys come up with the colors. Maybe you want, like, tan and green? Whoa. Okay, I kind of want to check out... <gasps> Wait, I see more. Oh, I see more. What are you? Magma block. Okay, okay. Ooh, what is this stuff? Obsidian glass. Oh, dear God. Oh, my... Dude, this is longer than obsidian. Or is this the same? Hi, bud. Okay, here. Um, Trust me, truly love you. I... Okay, how do you know I was going to push you into lava? Why, why is that thing that smart and sentient? Okay, well, anyways, uh, that might be something that i just come back for since you know we're right next to my uh waystone uh, might just have to come back for that once i have like maxed out netherite stuff magma flower seed don't worry i won't touch you be really careful oh, thank god i don't know why i thought that was gonna explode the things i do for cool building materials dude i want to collect that so badly okay maybe mm -hmm. build beacons in the nether i don't think i've ever seen someone do that and i've never tried that okay i think i've collected all of the glass around that scary area ah, uh, dude i really want to collect more of this this is another their block i would very happily build with but there has to be some faster way to mine this like there's no way and i think these stupid bushes just broke it yep i no don't shoot don't shoot okay would like a few more of these oh <gasps> no way there's even a blue one okay okay i like this Ooh, i like this area Ooh, i like this area a lot uh what are you yeah oh my gosh that blue looks so incredible oh my god wait is that blue obsidian oh Ooh, okay. Is that a house? I am not stepping in there. Uh, I'll loot you from out here, though. Uh, tomato seeds and rice. Asparagus? I don't think I have that. <gasps> Ooh, I will take your food as well, and uh, you can keep the gold sword. Uh, yeah, I'm not stepping in there. Ooh, another one. Yep, yep. Ooh, asparagus, more food, some gold. Wow, this green vegetable sure is delicious where did you get it skies literal hell let's see even though i came in here for some uh low stone got super distracted let's head back towards our voice stone and then let's get that uh, um glowstone all the way up there and then after that we're gonna go back to our base like i we're literally cutting it down to like the last minutes of recording so really hope that this episode was enjoyable for you all i'm really really sorry if it wasn't but I, I, I tried there's just so much to do and this takes so unbelievably long plus you know i didn't really have any of the blocks that i wanted to use for the building so uh, uh for everyone that wanted me to use other blocks other than oak and stone and oak leaves uh this is your fault and not my fault at all <clears throat> oh yeah that, that's how that works even though these can land on the ground and they won't get burnt up let's try and pick them all up oh boy I'll get you can i get these yes got them here let's try one more time okay I don't have any glowstone on me when I do this. Am I stupid? Wait, did this work the entire time? This worked the entire time? Dude, why didn't none of you tell me that this was actually working? Dog, I, I, uh, I could have been getting more glowstone this entire time. I never lost any. Oh my god. Uh, I, I, I don't even want to hear one comment on it. Uh, just don't, don't comment about that whatsoever. I don't want to hear one comment. Uh, if I jump down into those vines, would I be safe? Because I really don't feel like cutting all of this wood down uh i think i can make that i think i can make it i don't i don't think i'd miss that you know here let, let's try it uh oh my god i actually made it 
Ooh, wee, I am amazing. Ooh, and we got another block of glowstone. Okay, well, uh, we have 50 to work with. We can go back home and I feel stupid. In lighter news to make you all forget about what just happened. Uh, I've never had asparagus before in here. So nice, we actually got a new uh, vegetable from the nether. I've made it this far and I don't have a composter, really? Kind of impressive and not in a good way. Okay, let's see. You can go there. And whoop, don't mind me, gonna make a whole lot of bone meal. Okay. So beautifully, we got 56 bone meal from all of that, even though I like, already have a lot of bone meal in here, but hey, you know, I can always use more. Uh, anyways, so now coming up here, I kind of want to try and calculate how much glowstone I need, because just in case if I want to use like regular glowstone in the future, my god, am I staring at Neptune's bald head? Like, is this the second coming of Christ on my screen right now? Like, my word, you wouldn't even know that that's actual white sand and not concrete, like that is right uh anyways okay so we need one two three 23 more which actually ain't bad uh, roughly like that much and then we should have one left over and boop okay oh finally done it is finally fully completed which beautiful what happens if i touch you with water okay good good so you're not actually like uh white concrete okay then when we go down here so now i can actually like really get a like, nice like i'm scared to stand below these i feel like they're gonna fall and kill me but um anyway so oh my gosh that actually works so much better than what i was expecting like it lights it up the white leaves hide it like pretty decently well even though i don't really want it to be like that hidden that looks amazing to me oh i love that it's like a nice mood lighting next up all of the shroom lights how do i get into here uh okay we're gonna break you and wow that actually worked like perfectly okay let's see boop bop bing boom bing bop that uh, okay Okay. Uh, yeah, you go, go away. Shoo, shoo, shoo. There we go. And then on this one side, we're just going to line up all of the ones that we can. Even though sadly on this side, uh, how do I get out? Actually, it doesn't even matter. Okay, we can actually use a water bucket. Boom, there we go. There we go. Okay, that actually, okay, that kind of works. Just don't look too close. Please, no icicles in here. It's already hard enough to place you. Oh, there we go. Okay. And luckily for this one, we can actually put it all the way around, which, wow, that is like really, really bright. I like that. Very nice. Get out of here. And ladies and gentlemen, I give you the completed underside. And that looks so cute and wholesome. Issue is that a lot of the lighting is coming from the torches around here. So I don't know how safe this is to leave it like that. Okay. And then at the very least, Hmm. Okay, we might have enough time filling this area. So coming up here with how much light stuff we have, I actually think just mirroring this kind of up here, but maybe with planks might be a good move. Okay, wait, wait, no. Maybe we'll actually use logs. So I think I can actually just use regular logs. I don't need to worry about any of the end pieces because this is all going to be covered. So maybe we go red along the border. Oh God, no. Oh, I need to stop using all my diamond tools. I hope you guys enjoy uh, cooking with skies. Gordon Ramsay hit me up. Okay, beautiful. So for lighting, we can actually go in, I want to say like six blocks. And we should be fine. Then after six blocks, we need to do another light source in there. But I really do like this red. And I like how much it breaks up this like overbearingly bright white out here. So since it's still super duper bright, I think we just use planks next, especially since it is a different design. So yeah, we'll do that here. Ooh, lovely, lovely. Oh, okay. And then a nice transition block, I think would be the rock quartz block. So from here, we can go back to white. And maybe since there actually is a center. Wait, am I wrong? Is there a center? There is a center. Is there a center? Am I crazy? No, there is a center. Okay, I'm not crazy. Okay, good, good. I like to hear that. Okay, so down the center. Wow, that was perfect. So we'll come along to here and let's see. For the center piece, we can actually have some red. We can then bring some logs down here. Beautiful. Strip this. 
And then we have red planks also go down this. Even though it's all gonna be one massive room, I'm just wanting to, you know, kind of break up the build a little bit. I don't wanna have all these rings just circling it. I think that would just look really bad. Okay, beautiful. I actually really like that. So it's like a nice little center pathway. Maybe we have all bees over here and then like something else over here, or maybe it's just bees on both sides. Who knows? Um, ooh, and then let's also expand the log right here. Yes, yes. Ooh, I like this. Okay, beautiful. Beautiful. Let me go around, fill in this. Okay, next up. I actually gonna. I want, I'm gonna try out those new slime blocks. So I, I, I'm, I'm gonna. I'm gonna cheat, you know, just a little bit. So I know that these aren't red. However, I barely have any shroom lights. Uh. Okay. So we have to be a little bit creative with our lighting design. Um. Yeah. So I know that this isn't really red. I really want to put. Actually, I could put one down. Uh, hmm. Let's actually let, let me let me see this first. Like, if I put this down, I mean, it can work. Okay, yeah, like. I think I need to not strictly just do white and red, especially since like you, you can argue that that is yellow, not white, you know, as you can clearly see right there. So I think I can get away with using these. Um, and since I do have a lot of these and there is lighting directly below it, very luckily, uh, we can do two layers of this. I just have to be really careful because you become an absolute speed demon on this. Does it transfer? Oh, okay, no, no. no. So you like instantly slow down as soon as you get to the next block. Okay, well, at least I can't run off and you know die from it. Mm, man, that is such a beautiful sound. Oh man, I sure hope my editor doesn't turn it up really loud for everyone to enjoy what I'm hearing. And actually, okay, uh, mm, okay, so there is lighting below it, but actually let's try this so we're gonna then go and cry because we don't have any more planks and then we're gonna make more planks and then we're gonna go around and leave like just one block layer right there and we're gonna go to all of the blocks on the outer side of it and we're gonna put planks here this way once i finish this and i am so confused on how i'm doing this water please don't is water gonna ruin this oh good good okay water doesn't ruin it okay but um okay so the reason i'm doing that is just to kind of try Try and hide the underside of this. Like, I really don't like that that you can see it, but I don't want to cover up this bottom part of the goo because of the lighting right there, which, you know, the light in there actually does go through. So it lights up a little bit, given, you know, that's why this side's a little bit darker than like over here, but even though like we're just right next to that. So. I need to stop talking so much. I just, I, I like to ramble. It's enjoyable for me. <laughs> Anywho. Um, okay, so we haven't been using any white for this part, and that is an issue. I really want to use white sand. I won't lie. Okay, so here, we can actually use white sand, and here's a nice, easy way to get through it. So... We first use slabs on every single part that we want to use sand. Uh, might as well just make this build super duper expensive. Why not? Cherry slab and it turns into that? What? That was trippy. That was kind of cool. Okay, so we can put sand on here. I honestly think okay, I, uh, we might be fine on lighting, uh, but I think we should just go crazy with lighting. Uh, I think we go crazy with lighting. I think we fill in this section now, all with shroom lights, and then on top we just put this, and then boom. We'll, we'll just be completely fine with lighting inside, but I, I, I think we should be fine. Um, oh my god, I just realized I, I literally just made an omelet. Where the, 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 here's the omelet, and then here's like the table or the stove top, and then no, no, no. Here's the omelet. Here's the plate. Here's the uh, the tr the food tray, and then here's the table. Wow, I dear God. <laughs> so uh, yeah, 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 I hope. Hope you guys enjoy uh, cooking with skies. Gordon Ramsay hit me up. Uh, I would love to uh, end up on Hell's Kitchen. Why? Why is that missing? Wait, is the other side missing? How long was that, dude? Why didn't none of you tell me that that was left like that? Wait, so I, I had to use all of my uh, smooth glowstone. Okay, well, it's a good thing I had one left over. Hello, beautiful. And there we go. Okay, now it's completed down there. I don't know how I missed that. I'm just gonna blame that on my editor. Mmm, love that sound. Mmm, totally not gross. And beautiful. The second omelet is now done. There we go. Well, I hope I made all of you hungry. Oh God, even when you look at it from above, that totally looks like an omelet. Like, I swear I wasn't going for it. Uh, I don't know. Should I redo the design? 
or do you all kind of like how this looks enough like is it is it good or is it bad because i can't tell now because now i just i keep thinking about breakfast because man I, I don't know anymore uh okay well we're gonna leave it for next time. I, I'm honestly surprised that I did like this much work for it anyway. So I, my assumption is that, you know, the movie's about four hours long. So hey, I, I hope it was long enough. You know, I, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, next episode, if you guys want an episode three, hopefully I can finish this, get the bees going and get some honey. And then I really want to make like either complete the entire villager uh, trading outpost or at least make like a really good dent in it. I don't know. So yeah, uh, here, let's at least first just go get organized. Okay, Whew. we're at least fully organized now. Everything's ready for episode three, you know? Plus then uh, taking like, you know, like a nice little break from this uh, world and playing on the other ones, at least then I should be able to come up with a pretty cool design up here. Might be able to fix the eggs. God, I can't believe I made an omelet. But I want to check on my prizes. How are you all doing in here? I love you all so much. Where's my panda? Are you my panda? Oh, yeah, that's my panda. Oh, dude. Man, I don't know why none of you ever told me to go and save that one panda in my hardcore world that, you know, that's been trapped in there since like 400 days. And I'm on like day 2400. You know, I'm just saying, it kind of messed up. Uh, anyways. Okay, no, I don't want that. Oh, nice. We have another baby duck in here. Um, yeah, we need to make a duck area. I want to leave this just for the pandas now. So I would like to breed the pandas, see if I can get more uh, sick pandas, you know, like some more snot nosed ones. But yeah, I think we did a pretty decent amount of work. I'm pretty happy and proud of everything. Uh, next episode, we should actually be getting towards fall or summer. So that's going to be fun. We can actually like get some green leaves and god that looks so bad. Oh jeez. Yeah, but hope you guys can answer all my questions. Hope you all enjoyed this. Hope you're excited for the series on here. And yeah, I'll see you guys next time. See ya.